Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Keeper Tesla, and welcome to our first ever playthrough of Resident Evil Survivor. We're doing the PAL version, the like, well, for this region, the proper one. It's what David, Sir David, David, brought to the two year anniversary thing. Wow, it's mirroring the whole fucking screen. Here we go. Ah. So, um,. Well, first of all, welcome, welcome everyone. Dude, can we, yeah, is all the sound on? Yeah, okay, I didn't miss something. I'm still getting back my streaming legs on. <laughs> Good to see you, lovely people. Hello, John. Hello, Lyubka. Hello, love. So, long time ago in the year 2000 in a local uh, gaming magazine, this game was featured. I was like, holy shit, they're doing Resident Evil 4. Finally, we're going to play it. Oh, man, it's got to be... <laughs> so much better than Resident Evil 3, right? It's the next game in the series, and uh, it's neither of those things, really. <laughs> it's not Resident Evil 4, it's not, uh, it's not, <laughs> it's not a, even a proper sequel to RE3, it's just its own thing. It's an arcade game, basically, and uh, it works, um, it works like an arcade game. It's you're supposed to beat this in one sitting, which is what we're going to do. You can't save the game until you beat the game. But it's got a lot of replayability cuz at many points the game will give you the choice of three locations to go to. So three routes to take, three routes to take, you know, where to go and uh you know, every time you cuz you can't go once you pick a route, you can't go back and do another one in this playthrough. So it really encourages repeat plays. But it's, <laughs> it's, a, it's still a classic RE. Man, don't get me wrong. I like this one. It's been 15 years since I played it, honestly. But I like it more than, from memory at least, from the sounds alone, than, you know, some newer entries. I'm not going to say variations <laughs> because I might die saying that. But, you know, it's a, it's, it's a classic Resident Evil game from a different point of view. And it, you're supposed to play this with, the, you know, with a light, light gun. Go pew, pew, pew at the screen but that requires a you know a CRT an old style cathode ray tube uh, TV and we I just don't have the room for that right now and all the logistics are not there we'll get there but you know for today we're just gonna do a regular old PS1 it's actually a PS1 controller playthrough you know oh geez, it's fucking crows so yeah why the frame sis well because I don't have a green screen now it just looks better with the frame without the frame it just looks like a brick <laughs> looks like a brick so this is what i did before i have several frames i designed myself of course for uh for this purpose so you know if i get bored of one i put the other but you know it's because there's no green screen and it's just for a few weeks i'm gonna be here it's such a hassle to just screw in all the stuff for the the lights the the the, the green screen itself you know it's just not it's not worth it really so that's why the frame but um yeah, it is. I use a different format instead of it being wide, like before, we were being widescreen because you would see just this of me, but it would be a lot of space on the side. So I decided to just ch change it. Yeah. Well, thank you. <laughs> Hello, beautiful. <laughs> thank you, John. Yeah, it is smaller, but as you can see, the the way I set it up is so f so the chat and the alert box can let's test something. Like let's. Test the follow. See, so the chat, the alert box, and the camera need their space, and I can I can make it wider, like I said. But you would actually see less of me. I would be more zoomed in, but you would see less of me. So that's why I went with this. I think it's better. Zdravo Davide, kuchustara. Hello, uh, best man. It's that kind. It's not the Godfather. That's like if he's in the mafia, because we have used the same word for both. <laughs> Hello, Rumpy. Keep <laughs> Honda. Yeah, a lot of people connected to the car lately. How you doing, Rumpy? Let's get into this. So yeah, I've said I've I've shown the game case. I've uh, I've talked about it. Turn on the analog because you got to do that on this on PS One games. It I don't know a single game actually. Maybe one or two that turn on the analog controls by themselves. You actually got to do it manually. So <laughs> it's just you know remnants of the past before wait did that even make a sound yeah i did okay 
This is where, so people resubscribe sometimes and it doesn't pop here. So I have no idea about it until after the stream. It says, oh, I don't know. What was it yesterday? Lupka or zombie? Resubscribe? Yeah, it's not even showing here. I just saw it on Twitch. So I don't know how Twitch and Streamlabs are communicating. Let's get into this baby. We got to finish it in one sitting for the first time. So let's do it. Ah, the disc loading. Let's check the options. Logical choice. You gotta remember the controls. Uh, adjust screen, no. Vibration, no. A button config, that's right. I think it's like, yeah, X square. I might even go with pew 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 and then, because I'm playing a lot of Outbreak. Well, I'm not gonna be using the run button since I'm playing with analog, so it doesn't matter. And sound, please. Stereo, yep, yep, yep. All right, that's all we need. So square is back. Get ready. <laughs> the submarine controller. <laughs> I was saying earlier, uh, Rampi, I don't know if you heard that, but this game's supposed to be played with a light gun. Well, <clears throat> actually, let me get into that. This game's supposed to be played with a light gun in Japan and Europe, but not in the US due to shit that happened around it, the year of its release. I think it was the Columbine. But I'm not sure. It was one of those. They removed the light gun functionality completely. And they did that to a lot of games. Well, to, to quite a few games around that time. They modified them. They, some games were changed mid-development because of shit that happened. So, uh, you know, like if you're in the US, you, you can play this. If you have the US version, you can play this with a light gun. But European and uh, Japanese versions can be played. You know, you just shoot at the screen. I don't know how you move. I forgot it's been a long time. But like I said... Once we move the studio and I set up my CRT, we're going to play this with the light gun, just like we did play Dead Aim with the mouse. <laughs> if you Pepsi and there's no one to eat your brain, do you still make a sound? Michelle, Michelle, welcome, Michelle. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> Yo, motherfucker. <laughs> Good to see you here, man. Here we go. One of the most entertaining people on Twitch, Michelle Sui. Please give him a shout out, Lupka. One of yours, and I'll give him one of mine. The man deserves all the shout outs. So, Michelle plays No Damage, No uh, Save, Sand Hill, classic Sand Hill and Resident Evil games, and he's damn good at it. So, give this man a follow if you like that kind of stuff. Well, if you like what I'm doing, you're very likely to like what he's doing. So. Hey, always. Really good to see you here, Michelle. We usually stream around the same time. <laughs> European streamers. Everybody's free after 6 p.m. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the resub, Michelle. Appreciate it, buddy. Hey, man, with the whole moving and everything, you know, I was thinking even... Uh, I was thinking even to... Um, to, to rotoscope myself like you do. I was honestly thinking about it, but uh, but I, I was like, no, <laughs> it's good enough like this. Not today. All right. So you're, you're not streaming today. Okay. Thank you, Luca. Keep them coming. Senpai. Senpai has been supporting me since, I'm going to say day one, because I, I, as soon as I started streaming, I remembered I remember, uh, <laughs> I remember seeing him around, and he's back as well. <laughs> David's here as well. All right, let's dig into this, man. I've been podcasting for twenty minutes. Resident Evil Survivor. Let's -a go. Let's go. Re forget all the shit. Analog on. Well, that's pretty quiet. quiet Midwestern residents of Raccoon City. Can you hear that? An uncontrollable outbreak of the umbrella outbreak. T virus transformed the city into an inescapable death trap. Yeah, I was there. To stop the outbreak from spreading, Umbrella Incorporated was forced to wipe out the entire city. Was it them or was it the army? Like this the, the government the location where an outbreak <clears> occurred. <throat> You mean where an outbreak occurred? This narrator, narrator that, that this narrator, is really not giving it all. Is <laughs> really not giving it anything. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, it's the ostrich trucking. I remember a lot. So I last, like I said, last I played this game was 15 years ago, but I remember a lot. You know, people give it a lot of shit, but it's it's a fun game to go to. to. It's not. <laughs> it's far from being serious. It's like a weird arcade side entry, but you know. <laughs> hey, it makes us laugh at least. <laughs> I imagine Jim saying that. Shit's in fire, Thank yo. Thank you. Hello, Gamut. Welcome to the stream, man. Hope you're gonna have some fun morning at work with this. Look at that. Look at the acrobatics. Arnold is just like Arnold was watching this video and, you know, learning <laughs> how to do it. Him, Bruce Willis, and Stallone, like all three of them, they sat down and just watched this. Yeah, I know, Michelle. <laughs> oh, you haven't. Well, you're in for a treat. Blah. My head aches and I can't remember anything. <laughs> I gotta love that, like, break. That's such an unlucky break. My only hope is this gun with infinite bullets, if I remember correctly. <laughs> I must remember. No, I must I survive her. Where? Where am I? Oh. The real question is, when am I? <laughs> oh I, my god, that motion blur. I don't remember anything. <laughs> Where am I? Oh, can I? All right, all right. So analog, PlayStation Two. Yeah, PlayStation. I remember this. So if you push it lightly, he walks. If you push it hard, wink, wink, he runs. And was there a quick turn though? I don't think there's a quick turn in this game because it would be too easy. If you could just quick turn. If you use the D-pad, you gotta use the square like in the old games. A helicopter. Was I on this? I uh, just like it crashed on you, but you survived. <laughs> well, it's a it's a funny game, man. It's it's still like I said, it's I, I I rank it higher than newer games like, like fucking, I can't even say it. <laughs> Revelations. Love that the door opens automatically when you like when you headbutt it as soon as you smack your face. Yeah. So I was saying earlier, Gamut, uh, so this game in, uh, in Japan and Europe, you can play it with the light gun, you can shoot to the screen, you know, but that functionality was removed in the US release because of, uh, I think it was Columbine, uh, I'm not sure, it was one of the incidents, so they, they stripped uh, many games of, like, violent stuff, you know, we're shooting zombies, but don't hold the gun, <laughs> it's weird, but, yeah, the higher-ups decided, so... In one of the f in, in near future, as soon as the new studio is set up, we're gonna play it with a light gun properly, <laughs> the way God intended. But for now, we're just gonna we're just gonna go with the good old PS One controller, not even a PlayStation One, a PS One, you know, the the portable one. <laughs> All right. So what do I have? I have handgun bullets, which are I just seem to get out of my ass. You can check shit. These are nine nineteen parabellum bullets that can only be used. They can be used for various handguns. All the 9 millimeters. I wish the first one we have, Glock 17. Small, lightweight gun. So I always think Leon carries a Glock 17, but his is actually... David will remind me, I always mix them up. Uh, it wasn't HP Browning, that's, that's Claire, but it was... Glock 17 was one of the UBCS, I think. But it's handgun GL from Outbreak. That's Glock 17, basically. Lightweight gun, which made from plastic and is famous for its stability. Yeah, that's all we have. Alright. Wait, do I have files? No! Every pause cost me like a lifetime. No, just an empty book. I have a map though, which is pretty cool. You can zoom. Well, you can zoom. I already have the whole area map. Street area. Alright. And this is what I was talking about. These three doors. We're about to get to that. H and K. That's right. H and K. Was it? Heckler and Cochran. Yeah, it was Heckler and Cochran. That's right. I think you're right, Chris and uh, C Code, C D <laughs> Code Veronica has uh, a Glock 17. So does so, and it's also the handgun GL from Outbreak you, File 2. You look familiar, but 
<laughs> I just can't remember. He, he looks and he acts like James Sunderland from the intro. Observe as I cast a spell over my nose. Mark Thompson, huh? Though oh, I it's vibrating. Anything, I know that this was no way for anyone to die. I mean, he should have been more splattered. A little what? bit of, around the walls and all. <laughs> Down, boy. And he's got an item on him, see? But you gotta approach and it'll go like whoop. You obtained the rusted key. You can't look up and down without the gun. I'm not even sure if you can do it with, with the gun. It's been a long time. Rusted key. Key that looks... Looks like it could easily break apart. Well, I guess you can just use it once then. So, we have three routes now. The church, New Meal Church. The, well, they're not gonna tell us what this is. I think it's a butchery. And this is a theater. So I'm gonna go eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I'm gonna go to the church. Maybe, maybe God can answer some of my questions. Like, who the fuck am I? <laughs> yeah, they just pill gun. Ah. An L button, yeah, L button focuses on, L1 focuses on important things in the room and enemies, which is pretty cool. Umbrella Church. Yeah, our graphics are, people used to like talk shit about this game when it came out, but graphics are, this is a PlayStation 1 first person game, I don't know what you expect, you know. So, the, the, the original tr trilogy used pre-rendered backgrounds, so it makes sense that it looks better. Oh, I guess I can't climb up there. An old church altar. The world, the word umbrella, umbrella is written on it. <laughs> Locked, alright? Then the other one. Oh, that's the quick turn here. You press the LB to fo focus on things. That's right. LB, L1. Oh yeah, gamut. I, I'm still not playing it. I will play it before the stream, possibly, just to like get my bearings. But uh, I kind of have a wish to do that on stream. I don't know. It seemed pretty tough, so it just seemed like a good idea to maybe, you know... Maybe even beat the game. Ah, oh, what the fuck? Where did you come from? Did you just bite me in the face, dude? Cock shot. Down. Okay, we get these locations. Church, hospital, and mountain. Thank you, Michelle. So that's what we're gonna do. We're doing this for the story run, the canonical story run. The game we missed out on the marathon. So Michelle here helped. Thank you, Michelle. We're gonna go church, hospital, and mountain. I think hospital will be pretty easy to spot. But to get all the files, you gotta go through um to get all you gotta go through all the routes, you know, you gotta make all the stops if I remember correctly. So let's talk to that clock. An old clock is ticking. A clock winder seems to be attached to it. You've obtained the clock winder. Oh, it stopped ticking. It's not working. Well you you fucked it up, man. You'll it's like you ripped someone's arm out. It's like, oh, they're not throwing the ball. What's happening? But you can't explore everything, just like the things the game wants you to explore. Because this, again, this is an arcade game. It's not a proper, you know, survival game. Oh, I guess we got it. Chapel key. Oh, look at this art. Hmm. Wait, is that the... Holy shit, that's the Arkley Mansion, isn't it? Look at that. It's the Arkley Mansion. Looks interesting, like an RE game. Only the point of view is different, but classic RE. Yeah, there you go. Lyubka sees it. So hard you'll be uh, tempted to cheat after just one hour. A really resurrection? We'll see. I'll see how hard I can go. Then be, no more! Stop! <laughs> it is the Arkley Mansion. Why do they have a picture of it? I, I didn't notice that as a kid, honestly. Post-it notes we can't read. But really nice, it's got that Resident Evil st style architecture, which is, you know, similar architecture to, to Raccoon City. I mean, Raccoon City, as they say it sometimes. No one, no one's at any way, before we use it, I'm not gonna try, like in all the story runs, to check all the key items. No, don't combine. Appears to be the winder for a clock. Well, thanks a lot for that. There's a lot of really puzzles here. It's more flavor text than anything. 
It appears to be a key for a chapel. Yeah, I don't expect much. <laughs> Alrighty, Michelle. We got infinite ammo, so it's not a hard game. It's a fun game. And its story is considered canonically. Yeah. Church, hospital, mountain. Oh, well, that's pretty far. Am I supposed to feel threatened? Cock shot? No, oh, never mind. Correct. Headshots mean nothing, I think. It just... This is where the remakes were inspired from. By. This is what the remakes were inspired by. You're not even walking, man. You're cheating and walking. They're, they're wonderful bullet sponges. All dead, alright? I don't know if I should have done that, but let's see. Because I think I'll be back there in a minute. And The enemies in this game, in most rooms... As soon as you leave a room and come back, they respawn. So basically, they're zombies and they never died. Huh? <laughs> Look at that levitating book. I would, I would focus on that thing, man. Because that's some wonderful shit. You've obtained the church manager's diary. October 7th, 1998. I'm gonna assume he's an old man. Today, the leaders of each section of the city, including myself, attended a meeting with the commander. The briefing was on the destruction of Raccoon City. During the conference, everyone placed blame on William Birkin. He betrayed the company and wanted to keep the G-Virus for himself. The commander told us that if there is a traitor like Birkin in this city, we should execute him immediately without and without question. I wholeheartedly agree with the commander's order. Holy shit for a church manager. That's brutal. This city is as vital to Umbrella as that laboratory in Raccoon City was. No, it is actually much more important. We must not allow a biohazard to happen in this city. We cannot let Umbrella's efforts to buy the city and establish these billion dollar facilities go to waste. We should keep a closer eye on the behavior of personnel in the future. <laughs> yeah, I love that voice, honestly. I I just shove it in wherever I can. There's just that. I think there's a zombie over there. We're, we're check. What's this? Nothing? Looks like a poster for something. Darts. Ooh, even the herbs are floating and the zombies are ambushing, apparently. Make sure it's dead. He's dead, alright. Green herb, alright. Let's check the pinball. Is it some of the Capcom games? If it is, I can't fucking tell. Is it supposed to be... The war plane game, 1940? No. That looks like Space Invaders almost. That looks like nothing. That looks like Biohazard, I know. Blood Hazard. So, you know. Not not too direct references. <laughs> so that was just like what? A, a room. An optional room. Yeah, I'm gonna get jumped now. Because I did that. Oh, no, they didn't respawn? You shitting me. Alright. Locked. Wait, what about the map of the church? I should have a map, right? And there's no map button. Of all the buttons that are unused, there's no fucking map button. <laughs> so that's it. There's a lower... There's a... So yeah, I remember this is hidden stairway. Yeah, I'm gonna wind that clock. Oh, I hear dogs. No, focus on the clock. It's not working. You use the clock winder. Don't even, like, it does the puzzle for you. Tick tock. Well, I gotta say this L L1... Focus is pretty useful for this. Because you have two analog sticks, but they didn't figure out dual stick controls yet. It was Alien Resurrection that 
mostly pioneered it. I don't know of any game prior to that that uses it. No, I won't. That uses it, but uh, how do I reload though? Is there a reload button? No, I'm gonna have to. Oh, never mind. Just one spider. <laughs> I'm glad we got that on there, gamut. I'm being muted. Yeah. The shooting speed is so erratic. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> the way he fell. So we got that. Anything else? I swear I saw a, an item box here. Is that the statue from RPD? Church's rear door. It appears to be a key for the rear entrance of a church. These descriptions are just amazing. Why did you... <laughs> I would never figure that out. Like, would you figure out... <laughs> it's the descriptions, I don't know. Could have said anything else about them. Oh, the key is red and it's it has a specific tip or head or whatever. No, it's just plain obvious <laughs> facts. Ark doesn't fuck around. Oh shit. There's a dog we, we heard. Almost got me, boy. Can you hear the phone? I'm, I think they're calling me. Dog. Sheesh. Who is it? The phone hang up. <laughs> the phone hang up. Yep. So here we are, like I said, three three routes every time and three exits, so this is the exit from the cinema. You can never go back to them in, the, in this run. You, can even, you can't even go back to the first one, you know? There's one, there's two from the restaurant, and there's three. The phone hang up. I wonder if they would have used Sheena Island in more games if Survivor had done better. Yeah, really. Well, they mention it. They don't. They do mention it at the intro to zero, and I think even no zero zero. Oh shit! Never, never change targets with liquors. Ow, that hurt. They're they're really less threatening than they are in RE2, honestly. Reloading. Ow. All right. Like after all that, I got to caution. That's that's gotta be something. Cracked key. Well, as long as it's not a crackhead key. Uh, item. Tell me the key is a little cracked, please. This key is cracked and could break at any time. At any time. So not even like at any time. It's any time. Shall we step? What the? Because <laughs> of the liquor? Oh, who's calling? Ko je jam steba? Šta ti treba? Šta biš je jedno jaje? Ko je boje? Well, you can't see. Like, the draw distance is a PlayStation 1. You can see it two meters in front of you, and you know you should be happy for that. I love that Joe added those, Ljubka. Vincent? Who's that? 
wait. Am I Vincent? I remember this. Vincent, you are a murderer. A murderer. A murderer? What are you talking about? Answer me. Who did I kill? That's just rude. Calling me in the middle of the night, in the middle of the street. And then not finishing their sentence. <laughs> I mean, Silent Hill games have a point, you know. <laughs> this? Hmm. So there's library. There's... Oh, this is amusement club. And an entrepot, entrepot, I guess. Well, there there has been some pot in the making of this game. I'll tell you that much. Can you combine the herbs? That's what I want to know. I think you can. I'm pretty sure you can. Yeah, yeah. That's what I say. I mean, <laughs> at least they make some sense in the end. That's the. Like, what kind of truck? I guess because this is barricaded. This maybe maybe arcs the. Uh, I'm sorry, Winston is a cousin of Dorian, because like you can just jump over this. Look, just one hop, not even a hop, just put your foot. If it's so hard, just crawl under it. But nope, it's stopping and dead in its tracks. All right, hospital's next. Center hospital. Does it say center hospital? It's hard to see because you can't you can't look up. Oh wait. Oh you can open the inventory with the with the right stick. Good. Yep, it's called Center Hospital, I guess. That view is just horrendous. You use the crack key, and it cracked. Well, fuck me trying to read that. <laughs> I won't allow you to escape. You're going to pay for what you've done. <laughs> He's got some What? Helicopter? No. The cleaners have already arrived? Hmm. They must want this mess taken care of very quickly. You know, I will say arcs. Sorry, Vincent's actor is not as, um, he's not that bad, but this guy is hor horrible, just bad. <laughs> that intonation, there's no need to go back. Like, you can't tell me that. No map either? Well, like they said, you just, yeah. Oh, you can see all the previous maps. No, you can't. That would be too much to hope for. Yep, the hospital has a second floor. A first floor and a basement floor. It's not a big hospital, you know. It's like a whole two sick rooms like it does in this universe. There you go. Two sick rooms. What do you need more for? Yeah, just really bad. Not even enough. You know, it was the style at the time. Bad. Just bad. Funny bad. Phone doesn't seem to work. Well, if it hang up, you know. <laughs> various magazines for young people are lined up here. Oh, that's important that they said for young people. I do remember that. Umbrella employees, please, please. Umbrella employees, please your ID card. <laughs> I gotta make a compilation of, of survivor blunders. Please your ID card. <laughs> I'm, well, what I do with my ID card in my free time is none of your business. <laughs> uh, hello, Tara. Welcome, Tara. Good to see you. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> laughter is the best medicine, and boy, do we have some laughter in this game. Can I guess we can't break through that? We're not supposed to. You gotta please your ID card. <laughs> That's the name of the game. <laughs> so the the cutscene in this game, as you can see, uh, that before just now, the intro and no, no one else. Okay. The intro and what we just saw, there were cutscenes in this game. But obviously the game didn't have any budget because like even the cutscenes, they're not they're not you know CG movies. 
They're not live action like in the first game. They're not CG movies like in 2 and 3. They're just done in engine and then recorded as a video, I guess. So they would, because, you know, they if it had to load between each frame, that would be really boring. But this way, they just did it on a more powerful machine and recorded it. And that's it. Bob's your uncle. Medicine room. Is that what I want to go first? Nope. Then here. We're not streaming anymore. Okay. Do you plan to continue? Oh, big guy. No, 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 no. No, closer guy, closer guy, closer guy. Alright, good. Everyone nice and dead. Look, if I had a lighter now to just light them all. Ooh, a blue herb. Something gonna poison me? There's a machine, there's a thing. There's a fly in my room that's very annoying. No, don't check that. There is a switchboard of the CT scanner. Man, really bad. One of the worst RE translations, I will say. Got a... Making me turn manually game. So if I come here. This appears to be a control panel for the CD scanner. You've turned the switch on. Fair enough. Fair enough there. I mean, if Final Fantasy VI got a remake. I think I'd buy a new console for that. I love seven, but not as much as six, you know. Medicine room key. Let's see, is it a medicine room key? Oh man, these key items are getting lower and lower. This is a key to open the door of the medicine room. Interestingly, this is the model of the weapons locker key from RE2. They use the same model, same image. Maximum savings. So, for the medicine room, but there's nothing else here, yeah. Too bad I have to go through like five hoops to get to the fucking map there we go the maps are also pretty detailed which is you know very welcome as in you can see the furniture and all it was, was not a thing before that before this game so not all the zombies respawn i guess The UK sir, need help. <laughs> I hear more. Oops. I should have moved when I had the chance. Oh, never mind. He offed himself. Alright. I'm gonna use one of these greens. Get out of that caution. Was it item? Green herb. Use what? Yeah, this was the first game for me. Well, yeah, first game in the series where you could see your health change because it's displayed on the screen. The second one I remember was Code Veronica on the Dreamcast because the VMU shows your, you know, condition and you could see it change. But this one was b even before that. There are anesthetics, the anesthetics chemicals lined up here. That's the third one. Let's count them. That's the third one. Is there? A, I know there's a counter option. You check things by smashing your face in them. So there's no files. <laughs> yeah, literally just gotta go. Head, head, headbutt every door to go through it. I'm gonna say there's a guy on my right, is there? No? Bob, yep. Not today, sir. Not today. Man, that snap feature is very useful. Patients chart. Medical charts of the patients. Oh, multiple. Name, William J. Smith. Sex, male. Age, 17. Height, 181 centimeters. Weight 72 kilograms. Physical condition. Good. Mental condition. 
Languid? Is that good? I don't know what that means. Medicine. Tranquilizer, 10 milligrams in soup for every breakfast. Hallucion, 5 milligrams in bread for every dinner. What are you fucking these people up? Jennifer Campbell, 18 female, 165. That's 47 kilograms. Really? 47 kilograms? That's pretty light. Good condition. Mental condition, unstable. Medicine. Since she has been confirmed, confirmed, and confined for a long time, she has become very suspicious. Putting drugs in her meals is ineffective as she rarely eats. It would be best to put the tranquilizer in her drinking water. Name. Ryoji Yokoda. Male. 18, 177, 59 kilos. Physical condition. According to the results of an MRT, a vein tumor was found at his cerebellum. Worthless as a product. Removed. Oh, that's horrible. And it's an 18-year-old. Name. Karolina Albach Albachakov. <laughs> Albachakov. Albachakov, I guess. Female. 17. 155 centimeters. 43 kilos. Physical condition. Good. Mental condition. Good. Medicine, tranquilizer, 10 milligram in soup for every breakfast. I don't know why the doctor went Russian there, but love the name. Whoop, whoop. Her left, right, left, right. So I came in from there, but what about here? Oh, wait, not there. Here. Oh, there's nothing here. There's literally nothing here. Not even gonna comment on that, huh? All right, we move onward. My first person stallion. Wow, look at that tree. Look at the detail up close. Mm -mm. <laughs> On a CRT, it still looks good, though. Am I going to read that? You're not going to read it, and it's too low res for me to read it, so... Let's just move on. Okay, nothing else. Wait, is there... Oh, oh, it's the other side of the hallway. All right. Doctor's office. Which is connected to the medicine room. I see. The map. This is a guide map of this hospital. I already have this somehow, even though I don't remember anything. I just have all the maps in my ass. So what about the stairs? Oh, that was the room? What? Seriously? That was the room. Ooh, I remember there's gonna be <laughs> there's gonna be fuss here later. I just gotta see that once again. So the whole room was me exiting and going up the stairs. A weird design decision, but okay. Now check all the all the sick sick rooms, Morty. All two of them. Now there's four, I guess. Ooh, that's a first aid spray. Which side do I get it from? Here? Nope, from the other side. Just the door for now? Okay. What about here? Can't even go there. I expect too much. The doors, the window's broken, and there's an ivy drip stand, so... And blood. So the rooms do tell tales, like in classic RE's, you know? <clears throat> me, 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 me. Let's go next one. I gotta say on stream, so what I what I usually do for PAL games, they are, they are squished. Because PAL conversions were horrible. Ooh, a new gun. Yeah, this is, in Japan, it was called Biohazard Gun Survivor. So, handgun B. Survivor of guns, or by guns, I don't know. So this one has less ammo. Is it an HP? CZ-75. This is a small gun which uses 9 millimeter rounds but wait cz75 it sounds like our like serbia's gun <laughs> i don't know what cz is 
No idea. That's it. I have a new gun with 15 bullets this time, okay? Ooh, power. Appears to be the power for the switch for, of the elevator. You've turned the switch on. else why was there a gun on the in the sick room well, well even examin, exa, exam room the hospital patients records are stored here well there was one grammatically correct sentence mm -mm, even spelled out right I think that's the first <laughs> La. All right, next door, two o two. Well, that's a fast gun. Ah, I'm trying to reload here, man. down everybody man the TV just static like very annoying static phone nope I'm gonna talk about it So three, I'm sorry, it's not two, it's three sick rooms. My bad, my bad. Whoa, jeez, there was a guy in the corner? Ooh, red herb. Yeah. I didn't even check... Like how he comments the the herbs. Does he mention Raccoon City? This is an herb that can be used to heal wounds. RE2. Uh, they're all RE2 uh, sprites even. That can detoxify poisons. Okay. And what about the red one? Enhance the effects of other herbs. Alright. So red combine green. Whoop. This is a mixture of a green herb and a red herb. Good explanations there, good explanations. Zdravo, zdravo, mama. Hello, mother of hippie. I, lo I love calling her that now. That's a, good, that's a good title to go by. For me, at least. Štajima. Dal je vruć. Mi se podavi smo ovde. Radi klima, radi ventilator. Jedva čujem igru. Ali ništa ne pomaže. Dobro, pomaže. Nije da ne pomaže. Tell me that's not the elevator. That looks like an elevator. So I'm gonna go here first, I think. Let's check the map. Yeah, this, this is another doctor's room or something. Manhole opener. The way they fall down, I love it. It's like they're changing their mind a few times before actually ending up on the floor. What's in here? Aside from the manhole opener, you know. This appears to be a patient's x-ray photo. This is an oxygen cylinder. It reads, handle with care. What if I shoot at it? Will I kill myself? I gotta try. can easily get here if I die, but... Nope. 
I expected it to be like. <laughs> I don't know why I expected that. Blink, blink. Is it time for my old friend? Duh! Yep. Oh! There he is. Good old buddy of mine. That's the surprise he had in mind for me, huh? While well, reloading. Ow! Stop bitch slapping me. I'm trying to go. Ow! Stop turning towards him. You crazy man? He's like trying to kill you with his fists and you're turning towards him. The opposite of what you should be doing. Just three clips. That's all it took. Oh, now it's working. It's a tyrant activated elevator. You got shotgun bullets. We checked every room here, didn't we? No, not file. Yeah. Let's go to the basement. You have no choice, it's just... This elevator doesn't even stop at the first floor. Because I bet there's gonna be like... An, uh, a secret lab or something at the bottom. Oh no, it's the pale heads. And the... Ah! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! No, I'm poisoned. I wonder if I could have dodged that. Nope, wrong button. Just one more room. Okay, we'll see if this, if I even need to cure this poison. There's gonna be more spiders in the sewers, are there? Oh, fuck it. I forgot a lot of the game, so I'm gonna use this. There it is. Just yellow caution. Fuck it, cure it. There you go. Don't think about it. What about the manhole opener? Are you gonna tell me it opens manholes? Shotgun bullets. They're really shells, but okay. With the spas 12. Ooh, nice. We're gonna get the spas. Yep, same manhole opener. Can be used to open a manhole. <laughs> Quite an insight. Please, no more spiders. They're just cheap in this game. Very easy to spit on you. Well, we are in Silent Hill, I guess. What does the map say? I guess there's nothing over there. Oh, there is a room and there's a room here. So there's two rooms. No one is admitted is admitted to the room without a permit. Keep out. Nope, wait. Should I have gone the other way? I wonder what's on the other side. Let me see again. So that's one. That's another. Maybe that's just different approaches to the same sewer i don't know like what's on the other side now i gotta check you know be right back unless he says there's no reason to go back gotta love his running 
Oh, there's another manhole. So this is closed. Yeah, okay. So these are just, I think, exit points. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. I haven't missed anything. It's hard to miss shit in this game. That door coming into existence as I'm running towards it. Like Gamut said, Alien Resurrection is one of the best looking FPS games on the system and uh, it's also one of the better controlling ones even though, you know, nobody was into that when it came out, got harsh critiques. You obtained Jennifer Andy's diary. Andy? Are you a real boy? Sewer caretaker Andy's diary. Well, make up your mind. September 6th. I have never seen him, but I heard that one called Vincent has become the city's supreme commander. Officially, he is an elite sent by Umbrella Headquarters. In truth, he is such a fiend that he would not hesitate to kill his friend if it would promote him. Well, since I live here in this dark sewer, it doesn't mean anything to me. Oh man, I'm bad, I guess. September 20th. I heard a disgusting rumor that the new commander Vincent orders the facility personnel to do savage experiments every day on kids brought from all over the world. I don't even know why those kids were brought to the city, but it sure is disturbing. Well, I don't want to get involved, so long as it doesn't affect me. October 10th. It seems some terrible accident happened above ground last night. I don't know any more details, but I heard that Commander Vincent has done something cruel. November 9th. Today at last, Commander Vincent came down here for an inspection. We made small talk, but I could see nothing but cruelty in him. When I took a picture of him as a souvenir, he became very angry. He's such a jerk. Well, that's Andy for you. So, the dates he mentioned, September 6th, September 20th, just before the outbreak. <laughs> just before the outbreak in Raccoon City. October 10th, 10 days after Raccoon was blown up. Ah, so they, that's when the outbreak occurred there, I guess. And November 9th. So we're like, we're, this is happening at the same time as Code Veronica, basically. A picture? A picture? Wait, you let them keep the picture? Am I Andy? Oh no, no I'm Vincent. This is me. I am Vincent. It was all my fault. Who are you? Okay. Wait. Please don't kill me. Okay, just stop doing or the do Macarena. Don't anything kid. about you then. Stop. Don't go. It's you should say no. Don't go. I'm Vincent. I don't remember being a big kid. Shotgun bullets. <laughs> Overkilled being killed. No, I went a step too far. So that's just two things in the room, right? But so many photos. Andy had a quirk, I guess. Various pictures are posted on the wall. Too bad we can't see any of them. Even on the fridge. What's in the fridge? What's in the fridge, Vincent? So he snapped a photo of me. That doesn't prove anything. I could be Joel for you know all you know. That kid after that kid. I turned off the fan so I could hear the game, but it was a grave mistake. Spiders? No giant legion of spiders. Okay. Oh Jesus Christ! Clicker! It's a clicker! No dodging in this game. Huh, you missed. That was that was like the most pathetic clicker jump ever. You just move a little backwards and they're done. I think I could have just passed him. Not the spitters. <laughs> oh. You have nothing without the fan. I'm sorry. 
We'll have to listen some other day. Bon appetit, love. Ooh, paradise. I guess we're going to paradise. Oh, it's just one location this time. Let's go to paradise. I gotta say, this controller, I very rarely use it. So it's in very good condition. Oh, shit. That's a little too many. What if I run past them, like Henry Townsend did? Woo! Alright. Imprisonment area, I saw that. I don't think there's damage drop-off in this game, you can just shoot. I sit down, boy. Alright, so two of them. Office room. Employees only, blah blah blah, bio... Bio weapon? Something European on? I don't think that's what it says. Alright, let's go to the office. I fucking knew it. Die, scum! No, the other one, the other one. The, the one that's actually closer. Alright, good. So far, so good. It's a faster gun. Weaker, but faster. Much faster rate of fire. Yeah. So, what do we have here that's interesting? Just another door. Wait, the map should tell me more. Just one room over there. Alright. So, I probably need a key for that door. That I'm gonna find in this room. No, well, that's highly defined. Good luck. Ooh, a file. We will obtain the prison chief's diary. Da, 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 da. <laughs> October 20th. What prison chief? Huh? Today we received a reply to our report about the incident where 20 guinea pigs committed suicide the other day. He's got to be angry. The headquarters does not seem to have any suspicions and says that they plan to get a replacement guinea pigs soon. It's too late, but now I'm starting to regret that I sent a fake report of a mass suicide incident when it was actually a mass escape. However, as long as I stay in the city, it means death to me if I dare to oppose to Commander Vincent. Commander Vincent! I'll never forget the cruel smile of Vincent when he was shooting at the boys who tried to escape from the prison on that night. It looked as if he were killing a bunch of Vincents. Commander Vincent is indeed a very cold-blooded person, just as he is rumored to be. He is a true murderer. I am in a position where I'm supposed to report the truth to the headquarters, but I'm so afraid of Commander Vincent, I don't know what to do. Ha <laughs> ha, Lyubka. <laughs> I guess it's time to put the cookie down. Now! What is that art over there? It looks like a manatee having a rest or something. I don't know. Come on, Fedora. Come on, work with me. I'm trying to, like, put you on, Fedora. Come on. Come on, you stupid trench coat. Make me look awesome. Ah. You obtained... <laughs> you obtained... <laughs> I, I can't. You obtained prison cell key. Ah, yeah, yeah. Come on, prison. We have to dance together now. Ah. Ah. Stupid door, I get out of my way. That's like Arnold's favorite pastime. Destroying doors in these games. No be a girly man. <laughs> a girly man. You know I'm using that now, gamut. <laughs> it's like it really makes me laugh just as a as a concept. When I'm trying to do something, when Sasha's like, don't do that, you know, you you could hurt yourself or me, you know, that's dangerous. I'm like, I'm not, I'm, I'm a girly man. I will charge into 220 watts with my face first. <laughs> but also for other situations. Come on, zombie, eat a bullet. You can do it, zombie. It's not even a zombie child. If it were a zombie child, I would have let it live. 
Oh wait, we have a we have a key that we haven't read. Come on, where is it? Inventory, don't don't play with me. Check. This is a key for the entrance of a prison cell. Cell? More like a block, but sure. <laughs> hey Doa, don't make me open you. That was an Arnold one line. Stop dancing, zombie. I'm trying to kill you. Oh, so I can hang myself, you know, if it gets too tough. If life gives you lemons, just, like, hang yourself, because lemons suck. These are no lemons. These are more like... Squishy melons to shoot. Come on, bleed for me. Come on. I know you can do it. Bleed for me. Duh, 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 duh. Duh, 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 duh. Oh. Out of ammo, stupid gun. I want all the ammo in my pistol now. Come out. When he was governor, he, he, he used to call other politician godly man. Yeah, I heard that from you. That's why I'm using it. That, that just made me laugh so hard. This is possibly a clipping, clipping from a magazine. There's a picture of a girl in a swimsuit posted here. Baby punks. It's a girly magazine. There's a girl on it. It must be girly. Like these zombies are all girly, man. Stupid zombies. Is that Jill Valentine uh, from one of the epilogues? 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 On the left? Like if you zoom out sufficiently, it looks like her. It looks like one of the photos. Come on, where to go now is a prison cell. I don't want to go to jail. I was elected to lead, not to go to prison. Well, shit, did I miss something? Oh, wait, there's one room. Two rooms. Oh, I'm gonna. Can you imitate Fat Bastard from Austin Powers when you? Ah, I gotta, I gotta practice my Scottish accent. I'm no Mike Myers. I'll give you that. He's that's one of the voices he uses the most. He used it first time, first movie I can remember him using it was I think his first, his his first movie. Uh, so I married the next murderer. Then, I don't know, in Wayne's World if he used it. Definitely used it in Austin Powers, at least as a fat bastard, if not if not uh, another character. And, of course, Shrek. Like, all of Shrek, that's him using his Scottish voice. He just loves his Scottish voice. <laughs> I Married an Axe Murderer is okay. It's not fabulous, but it's a pretty fun movie because it's got Mike Myers in it. Wayne's World is probably... His most famous movie before uh, Austin Powers. It was like, you know, making fun of contemporary cinema, music. Oh Jesus! Why didn't you LB to that bastard? Ah! No, not now, man. Are you fucking crazy? Go to the cell. I'm sure here cornered, I'll be pretty safe. It's shooting as fast as it can render. <laughs> no, stop looking at the fucking car. <laughs> Are you fucking insane? Okay, this is, that guy lost me. All right, we lost each other. Nope, wrong cell, man. Wrong cell. They're all pale heads, though. That's worrying. Well, Lost in Powers is funny. For you people, for example, but it's too dull for me. So dull. Really? I didn't know that. I thought you liked Austin Powers. His neck has been cut open by a sharp blade. Did I do it? Am I Vincent? Are you Vincent? Who's Vincent? Ooh. More reading material. You obtained Young Man's Diary. Is it like Young Man's Blues? An imprisoned boy's diary. September 5th. It's not a small kid, so I'm not gonna use the small kid voice, but you know, he's just, his voice is just mutated. 16 days have passed since I was abducted on a street in Congo by the man in black and was brought here. I didn't understand that was what was happening at first, but gradually became aware of the truth of this city. 
We seem to be confined here to serve as guinea pigs for a medical company called Umbrella Inc. All the residents of this city work for Umbrella. Even the women and children are family members of employees. Man, you went all the way to Congo to abduct this kid. And you have men wearing black in fucking Congo streets. Streets of Congo. Like, that's so backwards. <laughs> Not <laughs> very inconspicuous. The guinea pigs seem to be gathered from all over the world. The guy in the next room is from China. The one from my cell is from Brazil. The rest are Russian, Japanese. It's like a world trade show. It's strange that they are all around my age. The youngest is 16 and the oldest is 19 or 20. Those guys from Umbrella sometimes take us to an arcade or to a nightclub so we can enjoy ourselves and relieve our stress. But I won't let them deceive me. I will escape from this place no matter what it takes. I must. Anyway, the most important thing to do now is to organize and gather our comrades for what lies ahead. September 10th. Recently, the others have been behaving strangely. It seems that they put some kind of weird drug into our meals. I sometimes lose consciousness too. I have to be careful. September 21st. I can't believe it. Another friend of mine, Chin, from the next room, was taken to the factory on the mountain. I don't think Chin's coming back. He will meet the same fate as Anna or Jacob, who disappeared last week. I know. I know what happens to those who are taken to the factory on the mountain. When they looked when they took me to a nightclub yesterday, I overheard a conversation that some factory workers were having. Under orders from Vincent, the commander of the city, they cut open our brains and extract some kind of material. Whatever they call it. All I can say is that Vincent is a devil. No, not just Vincent. Even the women and children in this city don't treat us as human beings, but as guinea pigs. All the people in the city are evil. I will surely be killed or if I stay here any longer. We have to hurry and execute our escape plan. October 9th. The time has come. Oh, that's one day before the accident. I have noticed the Umbrella people have been visibly disturbed for about a week or so. Rumor has it that there was a terrible accident at the Umbrella Laboratory somewhere in America. A month ago? All the prison guards seem to be very busy gathering information on the accident, so security isn't as tight. We've organized our comrades already. Stojkovic? Oh my god, that's like a Serb. That's definitely Serb. Stojkovic and Enriquez are supposed to steal the keys from the guards. Sankhon and I will act as decoys, and Yoshikawa and Felipe are in charge of gathering weapons. I, I forgot a lot of this. <clears throat> October 10th. Here we go. We have decided on our escape route. The plan will be carried out at 11 p.m. tonight. We have 20 members separated into two units. Unit A and Unit B. Unit A will go into the sewer through the ventilation slot of the confinement room, while Unit B will use a rope Rope climb down. It will use a rope climb down. Yeah, sure it will. A rope climb down from the surveillance tower. <laughs> That's fourth, at least. <laughs> we'll use the rope they use to tie us. If we fail, Vincent will surely kill us. But if we stay here, Vincent will order them to cut our brains eventually. We're dead either way, but I'd rather die trying to escape. Man, that poor man. Poor kid. He got, to, he got one of the... Worst voices I ever did. <laughs> I watched it because of Danny. He loves it. But for that kind of comedy, I'm more like the Naked Gun. Oh, um, I don't know. Naked Gun is a t totally different type of comedy. Naked Gun... Well, is it though? Well, Naked Gun is a spoof. And, it is. It is. Yeah, it's different. Austin Powers is more like cringe comedy. But also, you gotta know what he's talking about for it to be funny. He makes quite a lot of... Uh, pop culture references and you gotta know James Bond movies very well for it to be funny because if you didn't watch those a lot of those things make no sense but a lot of them are 
spoof of you know James James Bond tropes and even scenes from you know from the movies, yeah, like Odd Job. <laughs> Odd job in Austin Powers is called random task. <laughs> it's you know, it's not it's not as funny if you don't know the original. I'll just say that. Definitely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's my he's my sample for that. And stop calling me Shirley. <laughs> well, thanks, love. Oh, all right, senpai. Thanks for dropping by. Good seeing you. Good hearing you're back in streaming. As always, go watch this man. If you're not afraid of the truth. <laughs> Seriously. Thanks, man. Thanks for being here. You have a good rest. Yep, also killed. So I guess they killed him in the cells after they escaped. Nothing there. Same. I wish it, you know, if it weren't copyright protected, I would, I would like to have the Warner Brothers doing the good night, everybody, or at least Yakko Warner. That would be a good sign off. But I guess this one will have to do. How many James Bond movies have you watched? That's... Oh wait, there's more floors here. Second floor, that's the watchtower, I guess. And B1F... I don't even know if that goes to B1F or where. So I came out of... Wait, where did I... I came out of there. The stairs are working, so I'm sure the stairs are okay. Again, where, where was that? Let's check this room. There's a guy on the right, isn't there? There's always a guy on the right. Nope, I guess not. Ooh. Oh, I knew it. But you didn't want to... You didn't aim at them earlier, bitch. You just decided to do that now. Hi, please. Shotgun, yeah. It is the spas, like the the spas with the full stock. That's rare. Usually they're like depicted in games without the stock. Spas 12. This large size military shotgun can be handled with one arm if used with a stock option. Can it really? Like maybe if maybe if you're a space marine. I think it would blow your shoulder off, but what do I know? I never fired it. Ah, uh, yeah, so you're missing some of the... Yeah. Yeah. Strange you don't like Austin Powers then, man. It's like... <laughs> it's like the extension to that. Wait, what about this? The, I really, I'm really curious about the basement. This looks like an exit. <clears throat> wait, they said... Wait, 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 wait. Hunters? Hold on, hold on. That file might give me a clue where the mountain is. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. No, 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 no. <clears throat> okay. Stojkovic. This is Stojkovic. Okay. We have 20 members. Unit A, and unit A will go to sewer through the ventilation slot. Rope to climb down on the surveillance tower. <clears throat> I wonder. Those those look like alpha hunters. That should unlock the other side of the prison, sure. But what if I go down there? Jurassic Park gun. I forgot, was it? I mean, I'm pretty sure it was there if you call it there. 
Да. Wait, what about the stairs now? Oh, there you go. I thought it, they're like unuse, unusable. There's one. Well, actually, let's try this pass on them. Where is it? So shotgun shells are not unlimited. Well, that's a good one. Easy, <laughs> easy peasy, lemon squeezy. All right, handgun B, I guess. I do like. I think I like handgun A more, but why not? He was just turning towards the door. I thought it was something in the corner. That was excellently timed zombie escape. What does the map say? Just one room here. Okay. Oh, it's the moth. Wait, what the f what am I doing? Shotgun these bastards. What about the rope though? I want to see. This is a strong rope that could be used for mountain climbing. Well, exactly what we're going to do. Both dead, all right. Blue herb, didn't get poisoned, very good. Okay, so I do have two exits, it appears. I wonder. I had a hunter's up there. There's a hole which a man could enter. I could go down there if I had a rope. You've used the rope. Oh, I, I guess I'm not going to the tower. so slow seriously no dying for you oh shit I fucked up ah. and I'm into danger okay Mixed herb time. And also shotgun time again. There's another one. There's fucking another one. Oh, no sound whatsoever. I didn't hear anything. Welcome raiders, welcome. <laughs> Sorry, Wesky. Maybe because of the game, I didn't hear the chopper. Sasha, did you hear Wow, thanks a lot, uh, thanks a lot, Streamlabs. Well, thank you for the raid, Wesky. What was, Re what was Wesky? What was Wesky doing? Command and Conquer, red alert. The first one, huh? How was that? Yeah, Survivor, first playthrough on the channel. I was recently playing through Command and Conquer, the first one, on both Saturn and uh, N64. Never finished that game. I would love to. I think I finished Red Alert as a kid. Loved them. Those were my first strategies. Didn't know how to play them as a kid, but I loved them. What were you playing Red Alert on? PC or PlayStation or what? I still remember the PlayStation code for the nuke. <laughs> it was this, I think it was circle square, circle square, square X, square X, and you get a free nuke. <laughs> 
PC remaster, nice. So it's good, huh? I've seen those on EA, I think EA Origin, both the Red Alert and Command and Conquer. I wasn't sure how, what it's like. Good to hear, man. That's a, that's a wonderful game. Red Alert, man. Uh, what comes after that? Was it Tiberian Wars? Well, thank you so much, Rescue. Good to have you here. I'm just shooting some hunters, so don't mind me. I'm gonna go with this gun. It's more powerful. Glock is definitely more powerful. Fuck your... What's the... And mo stuns them more. Oh, gee, they can do that? You can, didn't tell me they could do that. Oops. Well, that's not good. That's never good. Ow! That's just rude, son. He just puts... That's good. He puts two times four shells. Can I ever come back? I don't think I can come back, huh? Nope. It's a one-way street. Well, okay, I picked the path. I don't know which path I picked. I don't think this is the, the mountain, but okay. I'm playing this game for the first time in 15 years, Wesky, and it's good. It's really fun. It's not the best of the uh, RE games, definitely, but you know, it's... I find, <laughs> I find it pretty fun to play, you know. And I did as a kid and as a teen, so it's not horrible. I think people were mostly disappointed, you know. They call it the Jurassic Park gun because there's a long scene in the movie where the game warden is unfolding the stock of a past well while hunting raptors. It's so gratuitous that it must have given gun nuts spoilers. <laughs> I forgot about that. But I, granted, I only watched the first two movies twice. Never watched anything past that. Uh, twice. Once each. I'm gonna go with the Glock. Definitely a better weapon for me. More hunters. I wish, I wish I was in the prison. Ow! No shotgun. We don't fuck around. Oh, it's easier this way. All right. That works. Yeah. Oh man, I wish I could reload it. You can. Can you do it at here? In the inventory now nah, we're doing no reloads that's that's a constant challenge on this channel ow ow no reloads you get midair bitch nice with my last bullet all right another green herb i guess is in order i just have green blue and a first aid spray Woof, not really good you know what i'll hold off for a little see how long i can hold off What is this area called? Sewer, North Sewer. He never got to fire this pass because the hunt, the hunters, the raptors ate him first. Well, isn't that? <laughs> love the love the emote. Poetic even? There we go. Nope. The right stick doesn't do that. Drainage disposition. Well, you, you make it sound lovely. So that's where I came in and I, I can never go back. Maybe I could, you know what? Oh, no, I don't think it'll let me go back because I chose a path. Well, I hope it's going towards the mountain. I think I should have climbed the tower to get to the mountain. I'm not sure now. Hello, BlickyXX. English? 
Yeah. Yes, we have English here. It's a Raptor drinking soda pop. There's a red one. Welcome to the stream, Blick. Green and red. Combine. Whoop. We're good. <laughs> well, we have English, we have Serbian, we have some Spanish, some some French. I'm sure there are more. That's the first four door. Actually, it reminds me of a door from RE3 probably, but it's still a slightly different. Something they didn't copy. Oh no, that's not good. <laughs> Die, Vincent! <laughs> what? What did he say? You're fucked, Vincent. A charge! Yeah, no. Ah, oh, really? Oh, shit. I've never been here, I think. What do I do? Do I fight? Do I run? I guess I'm gonna run and then ask questions later. Oh, no. You're fucking kidding me. Am I gonna die? No turning back, I guess. What do I even do? Use the shotgun, I guess. I've never been here. So it is a different path. I think the mountain was the other thing. Can I pass it? That's what I want to know. Nope, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, man. Oh, wow. Wow. Should have should have chosen the other path, the one I knew. Die, Vincent. That, that's what he said. Wow, he actually, he, his, his, uh, his premonition actually came true. Die, please. That's what he said. <laughs> I think there's a reset point in these games. Like you get a checkpoint or something. You have, you have bullets, I remember, that you use. Yep. I have four bullets. Four continues. Okay. <laughs> Lol, wrecked. <laughs> well, thanks, love. <laughs> but I can't go back. Oh. That's where we started, yeah, but you can... Shit, I'm stuck in this. There's no need to go back. Man, there's such a need to go back, you have no idea. What do I do with the... Alley Crocodiles? I'm just gonna run past him if possible. You can run past pretty much anything here. I wonder if I can even kill them. So I guess whatever I do, I shouldn't move. Uh, just ignore them. Ow, ow, I'm cornered. Ow, that wasn't smart. Okay. At least one of them. Bye. Okay, I saved up some ammo. Now I can shoot to those bastards. Bye. Oh, that's bad. Come on, shoot. Both dead. Nice. And we're not dangered this time, so that's good. Does anybody know what to do with the crocodiles? I guess I'm just gonna empty the shotgun in it and hope for the best. I think that's instead of another tyrant battle, maybe. So 
if I get to danger, it's already over. Gotta keep that in mind. I have two mixed herbs now this time, okay. Green and red. Combine, yes. And I'm gonna use this one just in case. There you go. So two mixed and a first day spray. Two, four, six shells. Oh, it didn't even heal me too. Oi. Still yellow caution. Because there's no orange caution in this game. <laughs> Die, Vincent! Yeah, I've never been in, on this path. Probably never went downstairs. What if I just don't go anywhere? They can't kill me if I don't go anywhere, right? All I need is to get to the ladder. Stop looking at it. Shoot, shoot, man. Oh, good, bro. Shit, there's another one. I shouldn't have turned. So I shouldn't turn, I guess. But that one's a little further, I think. I think I can still shoot the other one. Stop staring at them. Ah, my face. Oh, no more bullets. And I'm danger. Whoo. Man, I might have to restart the game. Well, I, I'm sure they're killable, but... He's dead. No, he's not dead. No, I, I was wrong. Okay, he's dead. Nope. He's dead now. Whew. Wait. It's not that hard when you have a full shotgun, I guess. Wow. Alright, that's some. that was something new for me. <laughs> just in your face, yeah. They, they just... But they reused... I didn't know they reused that in this game, see? Umbrella. So this is where the city is controlled from. No. Oh! <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm having flat... What's those happening to bags me? that flash. Heaven's Night, serious? It's like Silent Hill 2 tie in. <laughs> Not bad. So, what do I have now? Empty shotgun, but I have mixed herb, red herb, and not much else. Wayne Kent. <laughs> Wayne Kent. What's Heaven's Night? There's the... okay. Oh, man, I'm literally on the other side of where I started, right? There's the ostrich trucking. Yeah, I started up north, I'm pretty sure. There's... is there three paths again? What's Heaven's Night? Doesn't matter? No. I'm just gonna go somewhere, since I'm not sure where each one goes. Or comes from. Maybe there was just like prison escape locked, okay? I'm glad it's locked. I hate having to choose. <laughs> locked from the other side, okay? So there were, there were, I guess it depends where you go because I went through the hospital. I had a mini choice there. But if I went through the guard tower, where would I end up, you know? Nothing, nothing special. Nothing special.
So next time when we see crocodile, we just shoot. We don't expect it to just become a letter bag. Oh, come on, no shotgun, no shotgun. This one's much better at stunning, I will say that. Uh, oh, wow, you can do that? That one's dead. Oh, man, you got quite a... Re oh, caution, red, danger. Shit! Good. Magnum rounds. It's umbrellas falling apart even here, I guess. Nothing else? No? There's a recep reception desk. <laughs> a reception desk. I didn't get handgun C yet, at least. I don't even know if I do on these paths. I knew it. One of them is gonna be good. Definitely this gun is slower but much more powerful. The oh jeez! Ow! Leave me alone! Culturally, politely wait for me to reload. Headshots do shit here. That's where I came from, so I can only go straight and maybe turn left. Nothing there. What about this corner? And in this corner... It's broken and it won't move. Ooh, good thing I checked. What about this one? Oh, that's not even a door, is it? No, oh, it's a sh it's a big ass shutter, bulkhead even. Another Tyrant fight? I think another... Oh, no, wait. I'm in, I'm in the elevator, actually. Sorry. I seem to remember fighting the TO3 model at least once more. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. How about no? Where's the map? I gotta see where I can go. I can go there, all right? Then I can go here. I think this one's gonna be locked. No, I won't. All right. Well, they are, they are blind. I mean, yeah, they're blind. I should be able to just sneak, I guess, if I went slowly. Zombies, just zombies for now. As long as I don't have the shotgun, I really don't. Oh. Cutscenes have Hello? worse Can you frame me? rate Who are you? than the well, game. What are you doing? Answer me! So look. Answer me! This is my voice. This is how I talk. I'm acting. <laughs> Why are you being so weird, man? Oh! My controller is just jumping. I was here in my previous life. Was, oh, Jesus Christ, there he is. <gasps> I knew it. <laughs> He's gonna show up at some point. Stun, 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 stun. Run. When there's no stun, you gotta run. You threw my card on the ground, you bastard. I was gonna use that to escape. Now nobody gets to escape. You were a dick. I want to kill him to get whatever he's got on. Oh, he's got an issue. So this is where Resistance got that for uh, 
the tyrant to get stuck behind something. Answer me! <laughs> you obtain shotgun bullets. Nice, just what I need for my shotgun. It's completely broken. What's on the other side, though? Oh, we're gonna be there. We're gonna see where he... Br He's probably gonna attack us in that room as well, isn't he? There it is. A card key. A quad key. Vincent's diary. Oh, it's my diary. Hey, that's Chris's diary. It's not Vincent's. You stole it from Chris, you bastards. Or rather store it from... Who gets it canonically? From Claire. You stole it from Claire. October 10th. Last night, a group of guinea pigs confined in the prison escaped, took weapons, and caused a riot. The guinea pigs who were responsible for the incident were all shot to death myself. But it, was, it will cause a lot of trouble if Umbrella Headquarters becomes aware of this. This could spoil my plan of returning to Headquarters and collecting my reward for my great achievements here in the city. I ordered the prison chief to report the incident as a mass suicide, but I will also have to order the other who are involved not to talk about it. November 8th. The people of the city who have been opposing me are now trying to gather information, intending to report to Headquarters what I did. Yesterday, that little boy, Lot, told me that a spy sneaked into the city. Sneaked into the city, you say? Ooh, he really sneaked. He didn't snuck, huh? <laughs> okay. I guess that spy may have something to do with the rebellion happening here. I'll let him. I'll let him for now and see who he works for and why he is here. Then I'll kill him. It's a sad story that the only person that I can trust in this whole city is that little kid, Lot. November 19th. The people of the city seem to be preparing to hand the persecution report to the headquarters people who are delivering the new guinea pigs next week. They say that they have evidence of my doings. I can never allow them to reveal that. Those civilians will regret that they, what they are doing. I'll teach them what happens to those who oppose me. November 22nd. Now they know who holds the power. Avs. I would, I would totally yell in this document, but I apparently this is my voice. I've spread the T-virus all over the city. Of course, it has done so. I, it was done so that it looked like an accident. The city should be completely contaminated. Now I can go back to Umbrella Headquarters and get promoted for my great... Wait, come back. For my great achievements at the factory. No one can oppose me now. Wait, there is one person that I have to take care of. It's that spy. I have to eliminate that rat who sneaked into the city. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, I'm Vincenting here. <laughs> I welcome you in my family, and you disrespected me. <laughs> Hello, Nikolai. Welcome to the stream, Nikolai. How are you doing, buddy? Yeah. <laughs> welcome to the exploit of Art Thompson. I mean, Vincent. I'm Vincent, of course. Who are you? I'm Vincent. Nice, another Survivor fan. It's a pretty good game. They tried something different, and it, it, was, it wasn't liked at the time, but... Gotta avoid those clickers. Bye. Oh, what do you mean it's locked? Oh wait, I have a, I happen to have a key card with this door's name on it. But let me first check it. Card key. I'm sorry, card key, not key card. You have to love how Umbrella employees incriminate themselves all over the place by leaving these diaries around for people to find. Yeah, like everybody. <laughs> I have just done the worst thing in history and nobody knows but me and anyone who reads this that I just left on my table in an unlocked office. <laughs> well, I guess we'll find out, Nikolai. <laughs> yeah, I played this before, but I'm just messing, you know. This is a card key that can be inserted into a card reader. The word Vincent is written on it. The 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 the, the check, the descriptions of items in this game are just genius. Why waste time even to have fucking check command? I think they only did it to get closer to uh, RE fans, but 
it's like it's a broken key the key is broken it's a rusted key the key is rusted it's a jail key the key for a jail just rephrase the same shit we're doing good nikolai how about you my friend the umbrella credit card Nikolai does love res oh, love resistant love um, Resident Evil like we do. Why Nikolai R two? I always wanted to ask you. Oh, good to hear, buddy. Good to hear. Those liquors aren't much of a challenge if you just don't look at them. <laughs> I thought they were supposed to be deaf, but I guess they work like nightmares. As long as you don't look at them, they can't hurt you. Okay, who's the closest? You guy. Handgun A for the win. Glock over that CZ crap, whatever that was. I swear that's like Zast of a gun. I mean, I have... I think it's a Zast of a gun. Is it possible? What's CZ? I need a military expert. Where's Mammoth when you need him? Where's our arms expert? I'm gonna ask him actually. If, if the if the weapons wiki doesn't provide us enough. Info. Wait, this should be the room where the Quentin Tarantino bro broke in. Yeah, Brazil, Brazil, South American general loves Resident Evil. But you know, it's because of the culture, right? No, it's not that room. Wait, that's gonna be the final room here. Okay. Chrono Cross. Man, that's my favorite game of all time. So happy you played that. Have you played it before? Do you like it? It's not a game for everyone, though. For a lot of people, a lot of surprising number of people dislike Chrono Cross. First play, huh? It's a wonderful game. Have you played Chrono Trigger? Needs to be a control room for the building. It's it's no, oh, there's its system seems to be malfun to be its system seems to be functioning. I expected a whole different sentence there. <laughs> you haven't played Chrono Trigger, oh buddy! I would highly recommend. It's not necessary, but I would highly recommend you play that as well. You can play them backwards. People do that as well, but it's a different kind of sequel. It almost feels like Chrono Trigger is one game and Chrono Cross is another. But it's... I think it's one of the best sequels in history. Good, good. Such a good game, man. And the, the plot is just mind-bending. Let's check the map before I go anywhere. Man, why is it so hard? I think because when you enter... Let me try that again. I always get stuck on file. You can do it. Well, I don't know what's wrong. So now, there's a long room. A little to the right and a lot to the left. Oh. What? I see the same. It's me, your mother. Mom? My mother? My mother? Qua? please. Listen to your mother. I want you to leave Umbrella. I want you to stop performing those terrible crimes and just come back home. Jason. Dad, Jason, you have to kill them, Jason. <laughs> She's worse than Sherry. Shh, Let me go. Don't be afraid. I'm not going to hurt you. What is no, the tape you're missing? I won't. To? Oh, oh boy. I, I was only listening to it because I'm so bored. My brother told me to wait here. Oh, let me go. What the fuck? <laughs> She's struggling with her head. Oh, oh gee. Oh, there's lot. Put that down. I won't harm you. I promise. Oh, 
Like, this is the gesture we're talking about. Liar. You'll kill Man. me if I drop it. I'm not stupid. Now stay back. Don't come any closer. Why do you kids have British accents or like something like that? It seems that the girl. I know and... you think that I'm a murderer, but you're wrong. I would never do anything like that. These animations. So you thought Ari One was funny, Yuka? What about this, huh? <laughs> I find this funnier than Ari One. This is like five years later, and it looks like the animations tend to be crappier. Vincent's tape tapping record. <clears throat> Wire tapping record of Vincent. We can no longer tolerate what Commander Vincent has been doing. To deprive him of his position, we must obtain conclusive evidence of his evil doings and report it to headquarters. We realize that he is very intelligent and cautious. As a last resort, though it was very dangerous for us, was as a last resort was to wiretap his phone conversations. Finally. We obtained evidence that was pointed enough to deprive him of his position. This tape contains his conversations on the prison breaking incident last month. It proves that he shot those young people all by himself and that he tried to hide the truth. Furthermore, this tape reveals that before coming to the city, Vincent had killed his colleague only for the purpose of his own promotion. The dumbass talked about it on the phone, I mean, what a mastermind, huh? If we could hand this tape to the corporate corporate people coming to the city next week, he will lose his position for sure. Then the city will be peaceful once again. I don't know why this guy got this voice, but I love it. <laughs> it is super funny because... Wait, I want to hear my mom again. <laughs> Mommy, it's Vincent. I'm coming home. What is that? Uh, oh, it's the map of the island, I think. An island map. Am I on this island? Am I Vincent? <laughs> oh, look. Windows crashed. Well, that's what you get for using Windows 95. No hidden herbs? Nope. Alright. I love that eye. You know, we know Ari has a thing with eyes, but... Birkin eye is one of the most iconic. Ooh, a red herb. There's gonna be a battle here. I better get ready. Mixed and red, but no greens. Alright. Shotgun. Reload. Do I have any shotgun shells? But I do have magnum rounds, though. Man, that's slow as hell. Come on. Oh, I still have the card key. 357 magnum rounds can be used with S and W M19 series. So it's the same cult that Jill uh, Jill, uh, Jill has in RE3. There's a big hole. Something incredibly powerful must have created this. Man, you were there. He just like fucking burst out of the wall at you from this wall. It's the same wall. Are you looking at the map I'm looking? Yeah, that's the that's where he burst in. Dumbass. <laughs> Guess he wasn't present for that. There's nothing else there. There's elevators. Which one though? What if I want to use the other one, huh? What then? Broken and one more. I guess we're not gonna use that one. Elevator has not reached the store yet. You didn't even push the button! There he is. He's just back to his old ways of breaking walls. Wall breakers. Stun them with the gun. Whee! Hmm, you'll never catch me, copper. Whee! Mr. Tarantino is no more. Mew, mew, mew. All right, more shotgun shells. Thank you, sir. Very kind of you. 
Our elevator stopped at one floor. It's not moving, man. <laughs> oh, we're going to the 13th floor. You know that movie? The 13th floor? The movie that lost from Matrix? With the same topic. Though I like 13th floor more than Matrix, honestly. You don't remember. When they make a virtual world and shit goes wrong. Like... Oh well, yeah, but no, it's not the same year as the first Matrix, 1998. Yeah. What is this for? Notice. Notice what? Caution. For security precautions, please use your ID card. Am I gonna get hurt if I try to pass? Oh shit. I should have done that first. Yeah! Evolve liquors! Evolve liquors! Go down, man! Oh jeez. It's a really good movie. I haven't seen it. Well, last time I seen it with Sasha in like 2014, 2015. I couldn't watch that again. Oh, almost got me. Oh. As, as horrible the dogs are in the remake of RE1. As in... As damaging they are to the player in that game, in this one, like they make up for it by being total dummies, not in the least threatening. Oh, there's something. Oh, there's another dog. Oh, cool. If you hold LB, it actually follows the enemy. Oh, only when you're shooting. But... Ow, my face! That's my thinking face, I think. Ow. Ooh, a grenade launcher. Here we go. You see that, like, I really dicked around and I get bit once. In RE1 Remake, it's like you... The dog appears in the in the room, you're already bitten. You didn't even get to see it. They're really wild in the in RE1 Remake. But these are just, like, chill dogs. Chill dogs. Isn't that a thing? Chili dog. That's a chili dog. My ear balls. <laughs> I think Luger would be gun C, and I think that's the probably the best gun of the regular ones. Hot doggity. Bugovna! <laughs> hey! I can hear you, man. Just don't shout. Uh, somehow he... I didn't even get to choose a location. He was like, Here I come, shit. What about here? Oh god, it's... Yeah, that's me running through the... Po poopy water. <laughs> You change that sound, that classic sound. You, you reuse so many assets, but you change that squeaky gate. What if I just knock? Ouch! Wow! Holy shit! You, there's no, f there's no fucking with these guys. They always jump in front of you. Huh. I think I don't think they're worth the ammo. <gasps> Black Tigers? Really? What's next? Is this like a boss fight? Oh, shoot. How do they have a How do they have two Black Tigers? Fuck that, I'm just getting out of here. He's gone now. Oh, that's the house. Okay, so mountain is next. I don't think I've missed anything. Ooh, herbs. Yummy. Green. Combine. Somewhere there, there's a red. Because there's no sort function. For some reason. Okay, two mixed. Good. Another green. 
Wait, I already had a green? I was waiting to mix it. Oh well. Yeah, they're pale heads. Yeah, we just we we fought quite a few of them. I should continue to search inside this house. Ugh! Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry about that, babe. <laughs> He's not all well. That's a lovely house, just like off the road. Why is there a gate leading to a sewer? Like that's not even sewer, like a canal. I want more explanations. Are you one? Uh, Cerberus sounds in the backgrounds and RE2 zombie sounds. Wonderful. Yeah, that's like the zombie sounds from the from the from the city. Sorry about that. <laughs> Ooh, spooky music. I'm in a house. It's okay, love. Yeah. I, I was just wondering about the crocodile. That's the part I've never seen. That's why I was like, can you even kill them? It is an or it is an ordinary kitchen. There's nothing suspicious about it. <laughs> These line breaks. I can't remember anything. <laughs> Man, they have a microwave. They're living pretty good here. You know, save for all the zombie. So what do you think? What should come first? Well, I guess I have a Roth's house. That's supposed to be a lot, right? It's like one of those transliteration errors. Ropeway area. Wait. Was I in here? That's the ropeway area? Apparently, oh, I have no idea what is this trying to tell me. Is that the house? And if it is, I have... Oh, I think that would be the mountain, right? That would come from the mountain. I don't know, man. It's confusing. This is Rot's house. Yeah, that was the mountain. I would have come from there, not from the, here. Man, I've never, I've never done it this way. So it's not as canonical as I would love to, but, you know, it's good enough. I think I'm gonna check that book flying over there. Lot's diary. Yeah, Rot... It's actually a lot. That's an error on the map. <laughs> September 10th. <clears throat> we gotta use the voice. I saw some prisoners at the arcade today. They all had sleepy eyes. One of the girls even slavered. Slavered? What does that even mean? Slavered, maybe? Like, oh. Some of the boys were glaring at me. They wore rugs and smelled rotten. Like Dad and Commander Vincent told me, they are very different people from our Umbrella families. <laughs> Dad told me that they bring them to this island so that so they can operate on them and make them into decent people. Oh, that's not his voice, yeah. but just go with it. I think they are doing the right thing. I hope they will become decent people sometime soon. October 15th. I heard Commander Vincent killed those people who tried to escape from the prison. I wonder why why such a thing happened. I know they are inferior to us, but did he have to kill them? <clears throat> Is this what I believed in? Umbrella and my dad were supposed to help the inferiors by operating on them. Why did he kill them? November 23rd. Wow, it's quite a jump. The city is in total panic. Monsters are everywhere and they are attacking people. Those umbrella people who were who were very nice to me, suddenly started attacking me. I need help. Please, someone rescue me. November 24th. <laughs> my dad and my mom turned into monsters. One of the survivors told me that Commander Vincent 
turned the people in the city into monsters. I can't trust anyone now. I have to survive and protect my sister, Lily, no matter what. We have to escape from the city together. He's like, not that young, but you know, I needed a reason to use the voice. Oh, they're doing... They stole Laura's drawings as well from Silent Hill. Man, these people are just plain thieves. Hello, Lily. Hello, Don't Lily. Don't be afraid. I won't hurt you. Where's your brother, Lot? My man, the audio mixing in this game is horrible. Please, you have to save my brother. He said he's going to the factory by the ropeway. Factory? He told me that he could find a way to escape from this place inside the factory. But there are tons and tons of scary monsters there. I know that if he goes there, he's going to be killed. <laughs> I'm just supposed to be emotional, but I can't. What? What? <laughs> Please! We've already lost Mum and Dad! You've got to help my brother! Please! I need a fan again, sorry. Sorry, game, you're you're not saying things are worth not using. Don't the fan. cry anymore, Lily. I may have been a bad person, that. but that was before. That's not who I am now. I will save these two kids. I swear it. So he's... Is that an internal monologue? Lily, you hide here. I'll go find your brother and then come back for you. Who are you talking to? It's like... He's just talking to himself. The kid's all confused as we are. That's like... Oh. Street Fighter, there he goes. Uh, that's what I was expecting, some Capcom. That's not Street Fighter the movie, is it? I hope. No, it's just... It's some Street Fighter. Very very hard to see what it is. <laughs> yeah. I'm like... I'm, I'm an uncle to what? About 20 nephews? <laughs> By now? Man, there's like four of them, at least. At least four of them. Five. I can count. I mean, five. Jeez, I, me I meant to say five and I said four. <laughs> yep. Hold on, hold on. I just want to mix them. I just want to mix them. Another mixture. All right, three of them now. At at one, at one point, uh, it was looking like it's gonna be very tough, but here we are, still kicking. Hello, Dreamy. Hello, Dreamy Sheepy. How you doing? Haven't seen you in a while. You love this game. Man, I, I don't think I've ever seen you play a Resident Evil game. Do you like RE or just this one? Grandpa. No, not in English. It wouldn't be grandpa. It would be grand uncle. Grandpa is like a grandfather. But yeah, I am like, what, uncle to five nephews and um, grand uncle to three grand nephews. Yeah, I imagine. You're one of those people I can catch in my early morning streaming. Interesting. There, I didn't know that. Various books on Umbrella are lined up here. What, which, which series are you currently going through? Played a ton of RE4. Really? Really? So, Sheepy here, Dreamy Magenta Sheep, does something similar to... To what I'm doing, does whole series playthroughs. 
She's done so far Kingdom Hearts, God of War, the ones I've seen at least. Um, Spyro is now on the, yeah, there you go. Spyro is now on the, a new begin. What is that? What is the Legend of Spyro new begin? Man, the last one I played was Spyro 3. Three nephews and one niece. Oh, Gamut's an uncle too. So, but yeah, in English, we got to remember, Luke, in English, nephew can be both from uh, from brother and sister, right? Good, yeah, of course. Oh, it is a kind of a reboot, okay. I played the original trilogy a lot as a kid, but I haven't played those games. I haven't had them in like 20 years. I played them at the arcades, really. So one of those series I want to go back into, like on the PlayStation, because I got the Crash Bandicoot remakes. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is there something behind me now? They're just coming from the gate. You know, I think this is a good job for Mr. Shotgun, just for, you know, grenade gun. I didn't even check it. M79, so same as in RE2, American-made weapon that is compatible with various types of ammo, except... Is that? I don't think that's a real green. Yeah, it's a franking gun, really. It doesn't exist as such. Come on, I got. I want to line them up for a good shotty blast. Here you go. The shotgun has like infinite range on zombies. <laughs> it's just one shot. Everything that's on the screen. Oh, I love this shotgun. Yeah, it's the most fun uh, version of Spass I've have played with. One biological nephew and niece, and the other two nephews through my partner. Oh, okay, okay. Because I only ask, because over here we have a different word for a nephew that comes from your sister and the one that comes from your brother. Same as like uncles. Different word for an uncles and aunts, depending on, you know, where they come from. Cable car station. Okay, I didn't miss anything. We're actually going the right way somehow. I don't know how, but... Huh? I'm as confused as you are. <laughs> yeah, it is goofy, but you know, still better than some modern RE's. Just keep focus on them. Ah, there it is. Down, boy. All right. Is it cable car time? Hello, Najuni. Hello, welcome, Najuni. Good, uh... Well, shit. Good. Ah! No. Yeah, I was gonna say good. I'm trying to remember what time zone she's in, but... My head's about to be detected. For my body. Handgun A, definitely. I know it's slower than handgun B, so... Like, the Glock versus CZ. Glock, definitely. Nice, with the final bullet. How likely is that? He's not gonna talk to the big hole, I guess. The cable car is not working. There is no cable fucking car! There's nothing there! Oh my, some of the blunders in this game. Thank you for the shout out for the Juni. Resident Evil Island. What is that? <laughs> I feel a draft on my butt. <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> well, yeah, it's it's evening here. But I'm trying to remember because I thought you lived in Asia, and then you told me where you, where you are, where you're from. But now I'm thinking Brazil, which would be pretty like early afternoon for you, really. The white stairs back, yeah. Nothing to kill, all right. 9 p.m. Oh, well, yeah, she's she lives like close apparently. So it's like 8:40 here, 8 8:36. There you go. We're in the same time zone. Wow. Well, how did I? I'm sorry. I mixed something up. 
this is the service schedule of the cable car. They have a service schedule, so it's not like when we need it. It's it appears to be control panel for the cable car. You turn the power on. What am I fighting now? I knew it. How about no? Just ignore it. It's a liquor. They're pretty dumb. It's a clicker. What was it? We had three continues, right? But I think you get more. Man, they're the same 3D models from RE2. And good frame rate too for, you know, big spoops. <laughs> Anything to fight? Anything want to de decapitate me? Wait. Ugh. <laughs> that was random and very lovely love. You could have killed it before entering the fucking cable car, man. The decisions this guy makes. Choo choo! I mean, uh, whatever the cable car says. Did it just move two meters? I, I guess they skipped the trip. There's no way that just moved to the other spot. Ah! Well, I think the shotgun was up there. Should have should have equipped it, but I didn't know that would happen. One to the heart. I hear something. Oh, there we go. He's stuck, though. What to do, what to do. I'll let him jump. Ah. Wow, I got two of them with one hit, like Mickey Mouse. Where's the handgun A? Handgun A! Come to my rescue, my Glock. The shotgun is very useful in this game, I won't lie. So what is this, like a construction yard? Not gonna comment on that. This game came out after Code Veronica, so comparative it would have been a disappointment visually then. But for a PS1 game it looks good. Really? Did it? Did it though? I think... Didn't it come out before? Well, you're right actually. Sega was dying around 2000. I'm not sure now, you know. Definitely happens around the same time as Code Veronica. At least about a month earlier, really. Dude, we've been through this. You gotta stop doing this shit. More enemies. So him and more enemies. How about a shotgun hoping to get that dog over there? Fuck the dog. I was trying to kill the dog, but I shot him. Ah! Stop turning towards the things that are hurting you. Makes absolutely no fucking sense. You why you do that in the first place? Good thing he's really slow to charge in this game. Ah! Did you just hear what I said? <laughs> did he hear me? Oh, he's down. Okay, never mind. Did he? It's, it looked as if he died by tackling me. A month after. In the US? Or, yeah, in the US. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's what I was saying. It was delayed because of one of the shootings and, um, and you know, modified so it doesn't use the light gun. Which is sad. It's, uh, I remember it being pretty fun. What does it say? Umbrella Institution. Remember it being a pretty fun game with the light, playing with the light gun. Just as that aim is pretty fun with the mouse, I, will, I won't lie. I'm not even going to try to play that with the controller if I don't have to. No trespassing. Umbrella employees only. Oh, excuse me. It is, yeah. We're going to open the windows up and down? Okay. You can well, we don't need the, the AC then, do we? 
Well, that's suspicious. If I try to go there, I feel as if I'm gonna die, huh? Yeah, it's, it's sad, really. It looks like there's three routes again, but I'm gonna try. At least one of them should be the mountain. I think that's what Michelle was talking about. Good thing, where is it? Good thing this... This is pretty fast for this game. Cause, you know, I'm playing it on, not on the original hardware, on PS2. A fat PS2 with an excellent laser. But my point is it's loading pretty fast. I remember at the arcade where they had beat up old PS1s. <laughs> Sometimes, you know, you just wait wait for a room to load. It never happens. Elmona Mountain Road. That's the one. Okay, we're doing the canonical run. Everything else is so-so, but this is canonical. Underground passage under construction. No trespassing. Construction personnel only. And finally... We don't even know what the hell this is, so we're gonna ignore it. I'm not even gonna go there. Fuck it. Going to Elmona. My Elmona. At the time, Code Veronica was the best looking game out there until Shemu came out. Yeah. Shemu really looked good for its time as well. Where are we looking at? What's in the sky? Oh shit, he's seeing something. I'm not. Oh, is it time for the cleaners? I think it's time for the cleaners. They're gonna have guns, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I didn't... <laughs> I didn't see. Sasha's having a moment. You're adorable, love. <laughs> what was I doing? I was looking for what herbs I have. No, none. Ah, oh, jeez, there they are. They have guns. And they melt. Fighting Counter-Strike monsters. Pretty sure they're infinite. Oh, just one bullet, really? Well, that's pathetic. They're just a nuisance, I guess. Wow, that's the worst bioweapon they ever made, I'm sure. They made little Counter-Strike Man. They have to stop and shoot, just like a player. At least they're fair. I think if I leave them behind me, no new ones will spawn. Oh, they have lasers. They have snipers now. What does the map say? Well, that's a pretty, pretty big trail. Mountain Road. <laughs> like Panthers, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, man. This is like the weirdest enemies ever. They're called the Cleaners. They remind me of... Um, RE0. What are they called? The little monkeys? Exterminators. Terminators. Something like that. Just keep moving. They can't hurt you as long as you're moving. They, are, they have horrible aim. And they don't let go of a trigger, so... Once they push it, so... It's cool, I'm looking at the map. Nothing can happen, as long as I'm looking at the map. Eliminators, that's right, not Terminators. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're really rough if you want to do a no damage run. Oh shit, we have more. Okay, shotgun time. How about the grenade gun on them? I gotta try that, man. It's gonna explode and if it's good, it's gonna blow up two of them. Oh, just one. Wow, that's really bad. And danger. Here we go. Nice timing. Let's get the furthest one out of the way. Whoop. Nope. He doesn't want to die. I wish there was a shortcut for weapons. Please, sir, die. This one's on steroids, I guess. Did you just escape? Come back here and fight me, coward. 
Wow, the, they really loved that hunter apparently, gave him all the powers. What is this? No trespassing, umbrella employees only, alright. What about the other one? <laughs> the cat sound means you're doing a great job. <laughs> What was it? Was it drawn together when they say they're good enough? <laughs> Underground passage. Locked from the other side. Okay, so these are the exits. Proposed site for Bay Highway. I don't think you can go there, but I'm gonna try. Lock from the yeah, that's one of the, so that's one of the three paths again. There's a lot of replay value. The game is about three times the size you you actually play in your in one of your playthroughs, you know. Should have gone with the shotgun. Why did I do this? I gotta, I gotta be ahead of them, turn around quickly, blast one shotgun, and pray to all the gods I know, which is a lot. Whoa! No, not the bullets. Can't equip the bullets! Oh, that would be pretty cool and badass. Nope. When you're reloading, you're just like standing with Die, the please! I gotta try one more time for two. Try for two, try for two, no! Why do I even fight them? I probably shouldn't do that. We're not racing here, dog. Nope, it's a waste of bullets. I'm gonna go back to my good old handgun A. Because handgun B is shit. Eat my Glock. Now oh, that sounds like something Duke Nukem would say. Jesus, this view. Good. And the final one. Good. Midair. Oh, it's a mansion. I should really put more Wesky lines in my stream. My sound effects. The man deserves to be heard. All praise the West. Oh yeah, uh, before I forget, I don't want to forget. I didn't give Comrade Gamut a proper shout out. Here you go. Yeah, because I'm like, I want to space them, but then I forgot. Then someone else comes. I'm like, oh, don't forget. Then here you go. Ah! Thank you. Well, shit, son. Thank you for being here, Gammy. Two shotgun shells. All right, that guy's on steroids as well. Some of them, like the RNG is crazy here. I don't know if it's the RNG or they just program some of them like that, but it, that's, that's what we... Please do some dying. Oh, there's two of them, there's two of them. Oh, fuck it, I'll do it with the gun. Ow! Where's my where's my crosshair? I seem to be blind. Ow! <sighs> I tried to dodge, but stop there. Both dead. All right. Woo! Mods? You added mods to Outbreak? Really? Like what? L literally mods. Alright. There's another one. There's fucking another one. Oops. Another further? Well, that's why I got them. To use them. Oh, 
Too bad I can't move and shoot at the same time. Model swaps, alright. Was it recent? I don't know when I last saw you stream, man. There's been quite a period here, so... Oh, that's not a real door. I'm a real boy! It won't budge. It won't budge. Seems that it can be opened. Well, heavy door can be opened when you have the master of unlocking. Or if you use that grenade launcher properly. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think it's been... A, I'm pretty sure it's been... It's been a month since I stopped streaming since the roof started leaking and all that, so... I'm... Uh, Pretty sure I missed it all. Oh. Lot? Lot, you silly goose. What the hell are you doing inside a hole? What if I go upstairs though? Like, fuck, oh, it has collapsed. I can't climb on the You can climb, but it's not gonna lead you anywhere. What you cannot do is look up for some reason. Or down, unless there's an item there. I decide to focus on. It's me, Winston. <laughs> oh, that's why the door won't budge. <laughs> You're very careful going down the stairs. Don't want to break your neck. Ah! Seriously, man? I'm gonna try one grenade round on him. Wrong way, but you know, fuck it. Oh, I have 11. I guess it auto makes it. Did you just block a grenade with your hands? Ha <laughs> ha! I call bullshit, sir. I call pure, unfiltered bullshit. He's gonna punch me. Yep, and I'm gonna turn towards him. He's gonna punch me again. Maybe? No? Very slow to turn though. Oh shit, two of them? Really? Man, I gotta I gotta I gotta do something. I guess I'll have to use those grenades because they'll get two of them and stun them. But they'll both leave grenades or something for me. Oof. He did not like that. Oh, stop that! Just quit it! Well, I've gone this far now, I gotta finish it. He's dead. The other guy's gonna be dead in a second. Ow! It's my thinking face! I used it to think how I'm gonna kill you. Good. I hope you gave me something good, guys, because if not, that was... Wow, nothing. Alright. You got me this time. So I shouldn't have fought them. Good to remember for the next time. Lift's not working. Yeah, I sh probably should have just... Ran past them into the control room. Done, done my thing. You assholes. Wasting my ammo like that. Ooh, a Magnum. That's always gonna come in handy. S and W. Smith and Wesson. What was it? Smith and Wesson M19. Can handle 357 Magnum rounds once the barrel is extended from four to six inches. So right now it cannot. This used to be some kind of power switch. You turn on the switch. It doesn't even give you a choice. It's just like, you did it. Oh, okay. Looks like a map. Love the military march music. Power seems to have been supplied to this floor. Man, that's like... This is from RE2 the emergency elevator inside the umbrella lab diagram. Keep out. Well... Too late for that now. Going down. I guess. Okay, I was 
<laughs> the elevator got stuck. <laughs> Can't finish the game, stuck in an elevator. There's the naked zombies, love. The pale heads. Well, it was a thing in the first one, at the end in the lab, the second one in the lab, the third one, I don't remember them. And they... I don't actually remember them until... Until, um... Remake of 3. That's I think that's when they first named them Pale Heads. I think before that they were just naked zombies by the fans. And they would, they would respawn whenever you come back into a room in RE1 and RE2. What's here though? But there's two mm. straight and right. I'm gonna go to the thing with the red thing because I, I believe the thing with the red thing won't gonna take me anyway. Thanks for the lurk, Sheepy. Thank you so much. Enjoy the shadows. And good to see you as well. I swear I see you more on Twitter than on Twitch. <laughs> What about the other door, though? Can I go back now? Oh, yeah, I wanted to check the map. Okay, so there's one room here, but way more rooms over there, which means... Pretty sure this is where I'll find the key to proceed. The door is closed, it would seem that it is impossible to open. Oh, really? This is where I need to enter a input a key, huh? The power reactor is not working. An activation disk appears to be required. Alright. They're not gonna say mode disk, huh? MO disk. It has to do that every time you open the door. Like D bar them. There they are, they're back to their old naked ways. I'm gonna turn towards the zombie. The naked thing that's trying to bite your face off. Make sure they're down. So the this is for nothing, huh? Nope. Where does this go? Can I avoid them? I'm pretty sure I can avoid them if I go very quiet. Oh, it worked. Why? <laughs> well, that's at least canonical, you know. Acid rounds, my favorite. Well, no, freeze rounds are my favorite, but they're only in RE3. And only in the original. For some reason, some fucker thought it would be very funny to remove them from the remake. Holy shit, what is that? <gasps> the ivy plants. No, I won't. Different plants are being cultivated inside. They're not different, they're the same. What is this? Creature cells appear to be cultivated here. That's not a cell, man. Vincent knows shit. As in, he doesn't know shit. What about outside there, though? Yeah, that could be something, too. <laughs> I'm glad you do. Gamut did a great thing by recording it for you. What about the rounds, though? Grenade acid rounds. No, nothing important. Not even like what kind of acid. I think it was it was it the localization of Outbreak or was it? I think it was one of the walkthroughs from a game FAQs. 
They used to call them vitriol rounds. Ah! Lowest inventory ever. No item boxes, but it, everything is so slow. Good. All right, that one's dead. More? Is there more? There's the disc. You obtained the factory worker's diary. Oh, it's... I think it's Dario Rosso's diary. Background. August 15. No, August 5th, 1998. I can't stand it anymore. I have to take the subjects to the operating table and sever their skulls to extract a part of their brain. I do this over and over, day after day. It is awful. Guilt stays with me all the time, even after I go to bed. Commander Vincent instructs us. Do not see them as humans. They are just raw materials to be used to create tyrants with. But it is we who cut their skulls. I can never consider them as just raw materials. They are humans just like we are. I asked Commander Vincent about ways to reduce their suffering, but he ignored my request, saying that by using anesthetics, pure beta hetero non serotonin cannot be extracted. Even if it is the company's orders, I don't believe what we are doing is ethical. I'm sure that I'll be sent to the worst possible place when I die. Or perhaps, should I say, I'm already there. <laughs> I just ran the max and I combo. It's not Dr. Best Love, but you know, I, I don't know. <laughs> is it like, is that what... I actually never asked him, is that a classic Dutch accent? Or is it just him? But <laughs> I'll have to tell him this. <laughs> the, the briefcase. Yeah, one sitting, we're at the very end, loop cup. Activation disc. Alright, who broke the fucking... It's the tyrant again, is it? I'm gonna peek in and there's gonna be... Oh, oh never mind. God, just move! Bye! That's what made the sound. <laughs> Beta hetero... No serotonin, whatever it said. What the... That's what we heard. Alright, just ignore these guys. No flame rounds, so... Just straight over there, yeah. 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 Type R. So it's like new shafts, because they were L, M, and P in R, E, P. Just gonna slowly go here. As long as I run, I should be. As long as I don't run, I should be. Oh, okay. I just want to see what's over there, Licky. Just can you leave me? I just want to see what's over there, man. ID card. Release the door lock. And it's locked. All right. Was it worth it? I'll find out. So, in, like in RE2, they're they're like wild boars, you know. Can turn and, and run. So you just step to the side, and they're gone. That room was around the corner. There's gonna be a few pale heads here, right? Yep. It's the only RE I can think of where you can shoot with the triangle button. Well, no. Actually, PAL version of Outbreak File 2, you can, you can if you're crazy, set triangle to action, but. Why would you do that? <laughs> it's 
switch. Something's gonna burst through the unopenable door, I think. In the type P shaft. What does this disc say, though? Wrong side. Hi. I had two sides and I went the wrong one. Activation disc. This is an activation disc for the power reactor. <laughs> You've inserted the activation disk. <laughs> Am I supposed to be feel threatened? I mean, maybe from that motion blur being distributed to the facilities of this floor. Dance, Papa, dance! Turn towards the enemy? Oh, it's not even there. I'm pretty sure more of them came out of there in the cutscene. Whoa! You guys stuck in there? Need some help? What the? Am I not in the room enough for you? Shotgun time. Two birds, one shell and I'll need to reload after that oh wow this one didn't even die all right danger hot pipes So would they hurt them if they came close? I don't get it. Or am I supposed to stick my head in there? Wait, there was no card, was there? Okay, let's go. Let's see what's on the next one. Gotta love the music. <laughs> Someone's really loving the drums here. Holy shit, guys, how many times do I have to kill you? It's just ridiculous at this point. Lock onto them, please. This thing still does nothing, huh? It's just green. Wait, what about the door then? I need the card still. Someone's gonna... Someone's gonna... Drop a card? Oh, no liquors, I guess. Because this is gonna open, isn't it? Why did I do that? Did I do myself a favor or... <clears throat> a death sentence? Shit. Gotta get to that corpse. And these bitches can poison me. Just stare at each other until the shutter opens. They're not so bad, I expected them to be a lot worse, honestly. <clears throat> this appears to be a researcher. He's not breathing anymore. I mean, he's not nothing anymore. Look at his skin. Emergency door. What's the point of the emergency door? What is it actually holding in place? 
can anyone tell me? ID card of a researcher. You can insert it into a card reader at the factory. Well, that's the... I gotta say, that's the most robust description of an item they gave in the game so far. Oh, okay. Skip all the floors. Go straight to B. Oh, okay. I'm looking where the kitty is. Yeah, I saw it. Oh, these are poisonous. These are definitely poisonous. Well, enough that you shouldn't look them in the face. Alright, but they die fairly quickly, I would say. Wow, that one died even quicker. Expected more of a fight, honestly. We pushed the switch. Oh, and they left the blue herb. How kind of them. Oh, it's a biohazard door. Two. Flame rounds, definitely flame rounds first. I don't know what awaits me there, but there you go. And then the green herb. How many herbs do I have of what kind? Two mixed, one green, two blues. Let's not use that green yet. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you thought so too, Mayo, huh? Welcome to the stream, buddy. They are creating these monsters on this island. What? I am as shocked as you are. Why did you get such a cool... So, what is it one-on-one -on -one time? Stop turning towards him, she's gonna crush your skull, man. It's illogical to do that in the first place. Alright, he's very slow. I, I think we got this guy. You gotta love his unwillingness to actually try and kill me. Slow jog. Oh, that, that's the bullet that finished him. How are you, Mayo? Oh, that's rot. <laughs> yeah. I was saying, you know, when when I saw this in the magazines in uh, 2000, I was sure it's RE4. It's gonna be badass. And like I said, it was none of those things, neither. But, but you know, I enjoyed it nevertheless. It's been 15 years since I played it, so. It's pretty cool to, you know, revisit it. A long day. <clears throat> nice. You still enjoy Black for Blood? I mean, as in... <laughs> oh, jeez. Calm down, lot. As in... Horrible cutscenes, man. Like, five frames per second. Is there still to do in that game for you? Wait, he's... We did this with Ada already. Hang on! So the first cutscene was the an FMV. You can tell by the f shitty frame rate. And this one's actually in game engine. Shitty frame rate and, you know, compression artifacts. I guess I'll have to kiss him, you know, personally. In the face. Well, yeah, yeah. Close. What? I'm sorry. I really want to play versus in that game. Please, I mean, I would like to. What are you talking about? It's not your fault. 
Vincent is the one who caused everything. Well, I mean, I... You? What do you mean? You're the detective. Your name is Art Thompson. What? What? Really? I'm not Vincent? Then why did you run away from me? Because I'm the one that told Vincent about you. Hello, I'm Vincent. I've been transferred to this facility to inspect it. Nice to meet you, sir. I know Commander Vincent. So I knew that you weren't him when I saw you. What? A spy? Hmm... Thank you. You are a good boy, Lot. So then I'm Ark, and not Vincent. Ha! <laughs> the man's a genius. Just gotta hand it to him. <laughs> Lot, do you know of any way to get off this island? Tom Vincenzo. My dad told me that we there's doing a railway the station earlier. up ahead from here. A railway station? I heard that it runs underground. Okay, we'll use that. Let's go get Lily. Go Lily? ahead! I guess Hurry. he said. We'll meet at the station! <laughs> Self-destruction system has been That's not even how you say it. This island will self-destruct in ten minutes. Oh my god, they hired the Star Trek original series computer. Yep, that's the Star Trek original series computer. You hear it too, right? Ooh, a first aid spray. Easy to miss. That's where we came from, and right? Well, better check the map. Yep. Boip. <laughs> Fucking arc. That's right. At the request of my friend, Leon S. Kennedy, I came here to investigate. Oh, yes. I remember. I remember everything. Tell me the truth. You are a spy, aren't you? You took... Why did you have your dog tag on you, man? Who's... Who's piloting the chopper? Why was the chopper already prepped? <laughs> Uh, you, sure, man, sure. <laughs> yes, I'm not Vincent. I'm Ark. Oh God, this is this is some class A anime voice acting. <sighs> there used to be a shutter switch. It's currently locked, so we're not gonna do anything. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I thought that's the exit over there. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, like, two more rooms. You see how it disappears when you zoom out? Artifacts of 240p. <laughs> <laughs> Who calls their friends by their full name? Oh, shit, I didn't want to do that. By their full, uh, you know... Oh, fuck it. The end of the game oh, and that guy doesn't want to die <laughs> middle name and everything oh boy give me my 357 rounds all right one more i think oh he offed himself trying to kill me sometimes they just throw themselves to the ground Notice. Well, 
quite a notice that that is. The shadow locking area is being released. All right, that's what we need. Is that the kitty in the bathroom? Oh, okay. Two more the rooms. <laughs> yeah, it does. It does have that quality of acting. Uh, uh, I was just beginning to praise Ark's voice actor at the start. I'm Ark. This is my voice. Apparently, I talk like this for some reason. E area. More of these bastards. What if I just burn them, you know? Instead of wasting time with them, what if I just do this? What's the worst that can happen? Oh, I didn't check them. Are they rounds that have flames? Oh. Move. The green flame rounds, yep. Descriptions are <laughs> amazing as always. Oh bullshit! What what's the point of flame rounds if they don't kill Ivys in one shot? <laughs> Handgun A, please. I wish I picked up the Luger. I mean, it kind of helped, but not 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 much. Nothing's gonna pop in, but just to be sure. <laughs> it was like straight in the bulb and nothing happened. It looks like a tyrant that's about to be released. Well, that's supposed to tell us it's not the one you're killing all the time, it's multiple. This appears to be a terminal control that we know. I mean, this. Ufo Tyrant, you obtain how to extract the material. How to extract beta hetero non serotonin. To establish a system of mass producing tyrants, it is absolutely necessary. This should be done with Spencer's voice, but my throat is tired at this point. <laughs> absolutely necessary that during the process of gene cultivation, a large amount of pure beta hetero non serotonin must be injected. This material is one of the human brain's elements. It has been revealed that the material is mainly produced by the pituitary of people at the latter period of developing their secondary sex characteristics. Jesus Christ, just say teens, man, teenagers. <laughs> also, medical data shows that this cerebral material is produced in response to the excessive secretion of noradrenaline that is produced from the locus, locus ceruleus in the brainstem. Noradrenaline is the cerebral material secreted when people are in a state of extreme tension or fear. As the beta hetero non serotonin only exists in active cells, we can't extract it from a dead brain. Thus, the best way to extract the material is to cut open the subject's skull without using anesthesia. Ugh. This will cause the excessive secretion of noradrenaline. The pituitary is then ripe for immediate extraction. Vincent Goldman, Commander, Tyrant Plan on Sheen Island. Like, leave him a fucking address, will you? <laughs> uh, I never played XCOM, but <laughs> I heard it's. I heard good things. Ooh, another pistol. What about the Tyrant, though? I'm gonna take the pistol. The Tyrant's gonna go boom. The master key. The creature is being cultivated here. The creature being cultivated here appears to be ready to move. Right. Nope. Ah, he's gonna wait for the worst possible moment to do that. Again, another RE2. Yep, RE2 uh, sprite. Mo like, yeah, item sprite. This is a master key for the fight. They reuse so much from RE2 and 3. What's going on? I think my stick was moving. Right stick opens the menu. 
You know, I am, I'm gonna say, this is one of the stream titles I'm most proud of so far. <laughs> I didn't know what to name it, especially since it's just one episode, really, but... Uh, <laughs> Ark's name gave me a clue. Wait, where am I using this? Oh shit, too late to ask. Oh no, the screen's shaking. I'll just ignore that, I'm sure it'll be fine. Just moonwalk to the exit. Vincent! If it wasn't for you, I could have completed my mission. Umbrella was going to take care of me. But you had to go and screw it all up. Now, you're going to pay! And I know his voice from Dragon Ball. Blah. How did you not notice a giant behind him? No. Jeez. I guess it's time to fight the badass guy. I wanna just use all the powerful shit I have on him. Maybe save some for the final boss, huh? Oh, I do have the Magnum though, so fuck it, just use the acid rounds. They're good for living things, I hear. That's no acid. Oh, he's smoking. He's smoking. Oh shit, he can run. Didn't know that. Ah, missed me. <laughs> you weenie. Shit, he's running. Ah, I just feel him f good at this. <laughs> he's really bad. How about some shotgun now? As soon as I find it, just stay there. Don't go anywhere. As soon as I find it, you're dead. <laughs> yeah, like a can of fees. Please leave something. Your buddy's left. Ah, shit, you and your green blood. You fucked me over, man. Where do I use this? Oh, right up there. All right. That's where I couldn't open the door, right? All I wanted was to zoom out. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Don't forget the pistol. This would be a really good ga game for for arcades, you know, which it seems it was developed for at first, or at least. Oh my God! Horrible, horrible FMV cutscenes. Like I said, they don't use. They didn't make CG movies into FMVs. They just did in-game, you know, in-engine cutscenes, and then basically just. Recorded them in horrible frame rate. After RE2 and 3 having pure 60 frames cutscenes, this is just sad, man. The master key. Alright, he's right here. It's final boss time, isn't it? Or like. Oh, just ignore everything, not worth it. I wonder what was in there. Exciting! <laughs> but see, Gamma told me that it was released after Code Veronica in the States, but it's probably... There, I remember that. Probably, again, because of the... She's like bad. She's bad. 
because they wanted to remove the light gun functionality and mod the game for the US market, I think it was also delayed purposefully after Columbine or whatever shooting, you know, caused it to be edited. So, ooh, yeah, please. I was just running out of those. Aside from the infinite pistol, it's actually pretty good at, you know, if you don't, if you don't uh, save ammo, you can actually run out of special ammo. Good vibrations in PS1 controller. Yeah, here at the same time, but, oh. Oh shit, don't let them shoot you again. Just ignore them, they can't shoot you if you don't, if you run. Ow, stop that, I said you can't shoot me if I run. That bullet's pff, nothing. <laughs> Very weird music for this segment of the game. <laughs> I remember a final boss fight in some kind of a warehouse or something. I'm supposed to think it's the end, huh? Just over there. Nothing in the corner here? You're gonna tell me there's nothing, huh? Alright. Umbrella goes brrrr. I'm gonna talk to kids? Nope. Use the, the D11 elevator. 3, 2, 1, go! Ground floor. Welcome to ground floor. You're about to become ground zero. Yeah, that's it. It's like a store. It's a heliport, but I remember the shutter, so that's why I thought it was... Get in the helicopter! A fucking warehouse. Oh no, James Sunderland is gonna face off the jawless tyrant. It's still alive. Man, am I a genius or what, huh? Just Magnum now. That's what I've been saving it for. Magnum, Magnum, Magnum. How many do I have? 12, 18. Good. He's dead. Ooh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. I gotta stop for a second. <laughs> Is he holding me with telekinetic powers? One more. I like how they fall off and he loads them one by one, as you would in a revolver. Would you do that running? Shit no, but you know, we can pretend. Someone's supposed to give me a bazooka, are they? Oops. Magnum miss. Those hurt. Oh, there we go, he slapped me. One, two, three, four, five, six, let's go. Man, the Magnum really has a knockback. Or even, what's it called? Uh, recoil. Oh shit, I missed. I was too hasty. I'm out of bullets, am I? <laughs> good, good stopping. Alright, it's you, time to use those group uh, acid rounds. First acid, then we'll do the rest. No, that, that's it. Yeah, really awkward. Shit, it's loud all of a sudden. 
Look at that. Like, oh, no, my acting career, it's over. Oh, oh he's mutating. Yeah, we got to have a final mutation, of course. Open heart. I'm supposed to get a bazooka, am I? But a little too close, buddy. Where are those flame rounds? Go. Oh. oh, you gotta shoot him to stop him from. Okay. Oh shit. Uh, stop being hasty. Stop being hasty. I think I'm out of those, right? Yep. Okay, I could have moved, but I didn't. Oops. Maybe heal in this section a little more, huh? I think I have one green herb, yeah. There you go. Where's my mandatory bazooka? Ow! How many more? Didn't count. One. All right. That's all, folks. Uh, shotgun time. And I have five plus eight. I should be enough. The heart seems to stun him, but I was never sure if like the if it matters where you shoot the creatures in this game. Sir, please. Can we behave? Who's afraid of whom here? Right in the heart. Hypnos, yeah. Hypnos, that's right. Greek god of demons, that's right, actually. I remember that now. So, no rocket launcher, huh? <laughs> GG. <laughs> you haven't even seen my final form. <laughs> Here we go, back to two frames per second. Even the chopper can't fly how slow this is. Ten seconds to detonation. Why is it falling apart though? Well, how does that make sense? That's a weird angle to see this from. There was a fucking thermonuclear bomb there. <laughs> yeah, what, what a game. What a game. Worth playing, definitely. It's, it's late 90s Same. weird. It can't be. Yeah, that's it. Okay, I remember there was something. He survived that and somehow launched himself into... Get down again, come on! That's not how it works at all! <laughs> you know, as soon as it hits, it goes boom. It doesn't carry shit around. Especially something that weighs two tons. Wonderful, just wonderful. <laughs> Someone's 
moving the chopper with your hand? It's like a paper chopper. What are we gonna do, mister? Yeah, what are we gonna do? I... I don't know. But don't worry. We can fly as long as we have fuel. We can fly as long as we have fuel? So they could have died, just crashed into the ocean. <laughs> so if I'm if I remember correctly, now after the credits I get to save my game. Yeah, because it's made to be to be beaten in one sitting. You save your game, and uh, next time you play, you can choose you can choose different routes and do 100% the game. You gotta play it. I think at least at least three times. Yeah. But yeah, that was Resident Evil Survivor, or Biohazard Gun Survivor, as it's known in Japan. A very weird game. Not as bad as, you know, the press made it, but uh, doesn't have the quality of the, the original trilogy, I'll give it that. Obviously an arcade game, and, you know, the, the light gun just shows, but, uh, yeah. Man, I so wanted this to be RE4, but I played it. I even played the Japanese version, Biohazard Gun Survivor, and... I thought, wow, this Biohazard game, that's how I found out about the different name before, you know, before internet at all. This Biohazard looks like Resident Evil. <laughs> Think Mark's streaming today. Let's see. We can raid Marky. Thank you for being here, guys, and thank you for, like, going through this with me. It's, 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 it's an event. And th special thanks to David for providing this game, which... I was chasing for a while. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Thank uh, you. <laughs> stream manager. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, there's Mark. He's doing. Bye. Pokemon Yellow. Why not? I mean, <laughs> normally I go for a good segue from a game to a game. But when you go from survival, you can f fucking go to Teletubbies. No one, no one's gonna notice. So again, thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. We'll see you tomorrow in another Couch Wednesday. And it's one of my favorite co-op games ever. I'll be playing that with Sasha. So, till next time, stay well. <laughs>